I was chilling on the couch watching some TV and BAM Have you even seen much of it? Yeah, it's just it's like a it's like a PGR clone in a way Um That apparently is on the account that I can't rename my name anymore I named the account ball ball sacks Um Maybe I can rename it. I don't know Let's see what happens. Oh, username is already in use. Mm. We'll see what happens. Well, you know what? We can just keep my name as Ballsack. I don't care. Whatever. Uh, you've got three Sukuyomis in a row. You want to count? Jesus. What am I looking for at Aether Gazer? Nothing. If you get Sukuyomi, you're fine. Honestly, nothing. That game is that game is insanely easy. There's like no hard content for a whole year in that game. So, what game is this? This is Aether Gazer. So, um, I was pulling offline and I was about to do a reroll account. Let me uh, let me bust it over here real quick. I was going to do a reroll account, and um, so this this account name is called Ballsack because I thought it was a dead account. And apparently my name is taken because it's taken. But uh, so I did a final 10 pull on this account and pulled uh, nice to meet you. and pulled double Sukuyomi. Damn. That's a that's a goddamn like a hell of good goddamn. Like they should get her the SS like that's crazy. That is crazy. Like SS Sukuyomi right out the gate. Damn. Yeah, I pulled two. I pulled two on a single 10 pull. Check this shit out. I put it on my Twitter. So now I'm going to have to rename this account like Ballsack Curios or some shit. I don't even know. The Curios Balls. So uh, this account's ready to go. This account is good. Good to go. Good to go is this account. Um pretty pretty damn funny. Pretty freaking funny in my opinion. Um I still haven't even done my 40 regular pulls. I that was that was that was it. That was God damn. I don't know. Can I have that account? Yeah, yeah, you can have it. 100 percent Yeah, I'm doing good, Roy. How you doing, guys? How you doing? Uh, do you guys want to play Honkai or do you want to play Aether Gazer? I don't know. We can play some Honkai, then we can, I don't know. I'll let you guys decide. I am about to hit TL60, I think. What did you just come into? Me flexing my balls off. Tower of Fantasy? We played that yesterday. Jake the Almighty is like, I want Honkai. You give me Honkai right now. How about we play both? How about we play Honkai first and then we go into Aether Gazer? Maybe I'll do a video tonight on Aether Gazer. That's yours? Yes! We I did a random 10 pull before I was about to reset the account. This is a free to play account so far. I got a double Sukuyomi on a single pull on a single 10 pull. I was like, shit, shit. All right, I might have to play this game now and start doing some videos. Incoming Sukuyomi video tomorrow. Yo, bros, you don't even know how cracked she is. But is she better than Dark Osiris? Who knows? You guys want to play Honkai? All right. The Yonkais. The Bonkais. We'll play both. Uh, if you guys have not followed my Twitter and you want to see all the hot gaming boobs... Make sure you guys follow my Twitter. I haven't posted boobs in a while. You know what? That is a mistake. That is a mistake. Hey, remember when this guy uh, gave me depression yesterday? Remember this? Hey, hear me out. You're just pouring all this negativity on this game. Tower of Fantasy is great. There's not a single thing wrong with it. Now I can unsubscribe from your channel. Damn. God damn. Remember that? 
My wife must be so proud of me. I guess so. <laughs> Do a reaction to TOF uh, POV trailer. Trailer. My problem is that TOF 3.1 PV trailer is like three seconds long. Like, it's not even that long. Um, apparently, you need to restart your, P your PC to enable VT. Yeah. Um, yeah, this guy's molding. Been so long since I've seen you. Yeah, Omelette. Where you been, man? Where you been, bro? Yeah, three copies of Suros. The game is super fun. Which one? Either Gazer? Yeah, I think it's fun. Been busy with life, enjoying it. Oh, you've been touching that grass, dude? You've been touching that grass, my man? Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Guys, make sure you get your 400 gems. I think these were, I think these uh, exit. I think those are gone in the next couple hours. Get those gems. Get those gems right now. Or else. Yes, me touching some grass. Listen, I don't need to know what you do in your free time. Jesus Christ, okay? Jesus Christ. Did you guys see that this new uh, four-star light cone has Blade in the background in disguise? And Kafka is, like, texting him? Isn't that funny? That's funny as shit. I thought that was pretty funny. You don't think they work anymore? Is it too late for me as a free-to-play to get into Aether Gazer? Nope. Perfectly fine. That game is probably one of the most free-to-play games I could ever think of because there's nothing hard to do in that game. You'll finish all the plot within two days and there's nothing to do. No, I don't know. I have Listen, I, have, I haven't seen the new improvements yet. Where are those codes put in? Star Rail? They were. They might be dead. But yeah, we'll get into... Uh, we'll go play with Sukuyomi's boobs later. We'll uh, we'll make we'll make them bounce, okay? Listen, we'll we'll be fine. We'll be fine. It'll be a good time. It'll be a real good time. All right, let's uh let's get into the game. Ah, oh, loud. Um, so I think we can get till sixty tonight, but we might have to do some missions. Let's do our dailies. I've already capped out my refreshes for the day. So we'll see what happens. I realize I have to level 80 my um my uh what's what's the uh Ting Yun. So we'll have to work if we hit TL60, we have to work on Ting Yun as well. Which I may not have to re the resources to do it. But we'll see what happens. You're five stellar shades short of another 10 pull? Damn. Damn. Synthesize, use technique two times. Complete Forgotten Hall, blah, blah. I don't get this one. Complete Forgotten Hall one time. Like, what? Why is that a, why is that a daily? You're excited for Mommy Yukong? Wait, who? Mommy Yukong? The fudge? Am I blanking? Am I having a moment of unclarity? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, the bow chick. Oh, yeah, Yukong. Got it. Yeah, right. Um, I don't know if you guys have seen my video, but uh, I showed off some of Yukong's like Eidolons and shit. And uh, I don't know, man. I don't I don't think she's going to be very good. I don't know. I... Mm, uh, mm, uh, 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 until you get her to Eidolon 6, that is. I don't know. Eidolon 2, especially. Yeah. Uh, I showed off her... I showed off her Eidolons on my video today. Um, you've been so lazy to grind the Honkais. I mean, listen, you gotta do what you gotta do, man, right? You gotta poo, you gotta poo. Yo, man, we have 50... Yo, I almost didn't stream tonight because we could have done anime night because I got the new... Uh, shit. Check this out. Check this shit out, guys. I was gonna do... Uh, I was gonna do a movie marathon. We got the new... Um, uh, I got the new Sword Art Online movie. The Deep. The Deep Night. So I was thinking that we would have done a marathon. Watch the old one. Watch the progressive. And then watch the new one. Because these are pretty damn good. These are pretty... No spoilers, please. I have not watched it. 
but uh I decided not to maybe we'll do that next weekend maybe we'll do it next week maybe we'll do it after stream I don't know who knows I thought she's gonna be a imaginary Ting Yoon not really I mean she's kind of like an imaginary Ting Yoon but like one that's harder to use you know what I mean so I don't know how I feel about it Batman dies oh shit still waiting for you to stream uh records of the the lowest war yep I know I know anime has not been on my uh shit to do list unfortunately fortunately and unfortunately you just finished your uh tof dailies and neither gazer dailies time to watch some live streams yo june good to see you good to see you who the save for silver wolf or locha uh so i think locha is better if you don't have two healers uh silver wolf i think is a giant bean boozle is she amazing yes but i think she's only gonna be amazing for whales right now um a lot of people are thinking that she's gonna fix a lot of your teams and she doesn't really fix a lot of your teams until we get some further testing it's gonna require you to make mono teams which are really hard to do like you can't even make a mono team uh like quantum right now right that's really hard to do so uh and then we don't know and then so it looks like she doesn't take the enemy's resistances into consideration because her skill has two parts one she adds weakness and two she lowers the damage resistance of uh of an element of your ally so it looks like she like say the enemy's already weak to fire and you have a fire team she'll just do the fire buff over and over again why don't you collect the wine posters lazy we're being perfectly honest here do, 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 do. extreme laziness your team's almost mono is it um i i don't know i don't i i don't think she's gonna be good for free to play now i think she'll be good for free to play on the second rotation on the second rotation once you once we have more four stars and we can make mono teams with four stars but right now you can't really make almost any mono team with a four star ex uh, 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 uh yeah not really right lightning's probably the closest you can get if you pulled like Jing Yun. yeah no I think she's gonna be amazing later Sukuyomi I think she's gonna be amazing later don't get me wrong I think she's gonna be absolutely cracked I think silver silver wolf is gonna be one of those characters that you need but I think she's not gonna be good in the beginning part of the game until you can build proper team comps that's the issue that is the issue so I think I would rather wait and pull her later than pull her now if that makes sense uh all right we're gonna have to do some stimulation universe i think well let me ask you this so we have a thousand to go do we do stimulation universe or do we blow through some missions because i have you know i should have done these like a year ago maybe we blow through some missions oh my god i thought my missions were bad so many missions <laughs> oh yeah that's right <laughs> oh boy oh jeez. here we are tl60 with that many missions left listen i am a lazy sack of shit if you don't know that about me i am a lazy sack of shit the thing is silver wolf also counts as an ally so you can't really guarantee a uh, weakness ad 
Silver Wolf does not count as an ally from what from what I understand. Do you have any do you have any proof of that? Because what from what some of uh some of the content creators on Billy Billy were saying, it only counts for the other three. I don't think so. But maybe who knows? Who knows? You have Bailu, but not Jepard. Do you think Locha would still be worth it? Uh, if you have Bailu and Natasha, I don't know if Locha would be worth it. But if you're playing the pull Blade or Jingli, I have a feeling that you're going to need Locha. Oh, also, speaking of that, um, I haven't posted it to my Twitter, but there was a leak tonight. They are adding two new pieces of gear sets. Let me see if I can pull it up. I, I took a I took a screenshot. Um doo, 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 doo. let me see if I can find it. Oh yeah, here we go. I mean I'm just gonna verbally tell you guys. Uh there is a new There's a new four piece. Two I think there's two new four piece sets. Uh, the long discipline, long, um, increases the wearer's max HP by X percent on the two piece, four PC, uh, four piece when a wearer is attacked or his health is consumed, crit uh, rate is increased by X amount of percentage for X amount of rounds, stacks X amount of times. If that doesn't say blade and Jing Li all over it, I don't know what does. So don't, if you're farming for blade, don't farm for blade. There's probably a new set coming. Um, there's also apparently a speed set coming. Uh, two piece speed is increased by X amount. When the wearer casts uh, the ultimate speed is also increased increased by X amount. So apparently there's a speed set coming too. So I would not uh, overly farm gear as of right now. Yo Ward, what's going on, dude? What is this? Hello. I only have all the old gear sets. Yeah, right. Uh, what? Harley will be goaded. Yeah. Speed sounds good. Well, it could be. So it's probably going to happen. There's a character coming out that's just barely or that's uh, purely based off. Uh, that's purely based off um, speed. You know, so it might be good. You have any guides on Honkai and YouTube? No, I haven't. Um, I I haven't done anything on YouTube, and not even a single video. Yeah, I mean there is. No, there is. There is. Uh, not even a single short hey our shorts have been doing good oh i was gonna do a short tonight uh uh we were able to hit for one point uh joe pet was able to uh finally hit over a million damage with his uh zila so i was gonna make a short tonight where i uh cream my pants for tomorrow sundays are the good times for creaming pants hmm Hmm. You saw a 3 million Zilla video recently? Listen, no one gives a shit about whales. <laughs> That's probably right, though. That's probably right. Mm -hmm. I want to see free to play in the title. Me watching it is going to be free to play. Free to play pog face. Cream's pants at one million damage. Uh, Kappa. Bum, bum, bum. What am I clicking on? Hello, oh my dear lord. 
Are you not home supposed to talk to? The window. The, mm. Items achieved. Was it? Yeah, I wasn't even supposed to talk to you. No, shut up! Damn it, Asta! Wait, speed is increased? Wait a second. Did that did I read that set right? Speeds increase, and when the wear caster ultimate speeds increased again? <gasps> it's a new Asta set. Oh my god, she's gonna be so fast! I'm gonna get my ass up to like 300. So when when Coquel when Coca uh Cocolia is really you know, really diving into my ass though, right? She'll be able to outspeed her. That'll be good. That'll be good times. Uh, are these the nope? You know what I'm really missing? A lot of uh, missions in the Joe. Mm -mm -mm. All right. Do we have any more 250s? 250, 250. Nope. You know what else I haven't done? This gives me, this gives me depression. Just looking at this. <laughs> this is like, this is me. This is me in real life. Does anyone have like a bunch of friends that text them and you just can't bring yourself to text back? That's how you lose friendships, by the way. <laughs> Yo, Kendra, good to see you. Uh, don't do, don't, don't do what I do. Apparently. Heroes, he's having showing, uh, showing with 300 speed. You know, it'd be, I tried to get 300 speed for like a bajillion years in Epic seven. I did not get a single speed piece that was over like 14. That game hated me. That game hated me when it came to speed pieces. Now, listen, I don't even want to hear it, dude. The fastest person I ever had on my team was like 240. And that was like... That was it. Was that really the end of the mission? Wow. Really delayed that one. <laughs> really... Really, uh, really winning at life right now. Uh, uh. Oh, it's this mission. Also, what are you streaming today? We're going to stream Honkai and then Aether Gazer. Show of hands. How many people are playing Aether Gazer? Dun, 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 dun. Do, do, do. No, 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 no. Not me, 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 not me, 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 me. Oh, here you guys go then. If you guys want, I was doing my re I was doing my third reroll today. If you guys don't follow me on Twitter, you probably probably is a good sign. Does this make you jelly? This was on my third ten pull. Wait, why did I pull up Honkai Star Rail on Twitter? And the first thing I see is like these boobs. A crazy old man has boobs in the top right hand corner. Apparently he's Asian. Dijin whale, lover, smasher, hugger of Asians. If that is not... Dear Lord. Dear Mother of God, what did I just read? We're gonna pass. Knows what he wants. Yeah. Listen, that's like that's like a one way street to getting canceled. I mean, listen, I'm all about boobs and shit, right? But like, you know, you gotta you gotta have some reference behind it. Sorry, Dan, you can't afford it. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's definitely dangerous. He likes to get spanked. Hmm. Who doesn't like to get spanked? Actually, I'll be honest. I'm going to share something with you guys. It's a little TMI. I am not a fan of pain. I am not a fan. That is, that is not my kink. Dear God. Dear God, no. No. At one time, like, you know, yeah, anyways, you know, I'm not going to share too much, right? But my, uh, I remember my cat clawed me in the back. Like, she tried to jump up on the bed and landed on my back. And I was like, ah! And I was done. I was done. I was like, I can't do this right now. I'll come back in like 24 hours. I'm out. Lost it. <laughs> Is re rolling a pain? It can be. Can be. Yeah, yep, that's a rain check. Yep. <laughs> really cute, but it hurts like hell. Yeah. <laughs> yep, that was like, I was done. I was like, I was like, yep, yeah, it's just not going to happen. Sorry. That is, uh,. That's a no-go on the pain. Click the function button to take a picture. Isn't that great? Isn't that great? Pictures. Uh, yeah, go back here. Hit the V button. Man, I can't believe I haven't done any of these missions. This is crazy. This is crazy. All right, we're making our way. Road to re revival done. We're almost there with missions. I don't want to do the companion missions because they're so talky. What about this one? Let's do this one right here. Ah, uh, the good old mine carts. Let's go. More mine carts. What the? What? Wait. I don't want to read. Just tell me. Wait. So fudge. Am I supposed to like push this thing? Push it. And then, and then I flip the switch. Yeah. Bingo. Push that shit back. Get over there. Easy. Wait, did I not do it? Yo, true frost zero. How's it going? Yo guys, we were gonna watch uh we were gonna watch an anime movie night tonight. And I decided to stream. Cause I'm terrible. Wait, what the fudge? Did I not do this right? Pass the senior minecarts operators test. How was that not right? How much crit is too much on Yang Shing? I think you only need about 30 to 40 percent. Do you do that in Discord? Yep. I got the new I got the new movie for us to watch. I mean maybe we'll do it later tonight. I don't know. Maybe we do a short stream. I picked up um I picked up the new Sword Art Progressive movie. If you haven't seen the previous Sword Art Progressive movie, which we've watched in the Discord many times, this movie is actually fire. Like, listen, like I, I'm not the biggest Sword Art fan after the first season, but the progressive movies have been absolutely fire. Um so the first one was really good. I'm really excited for the second one. I just got it. I just got it. 
So I'm really excited to maybe experience that with you guys. I should have just done a movie night tonight. That's what I should have done. Wait, what is happening right now? Wait, what though? Am I supposed to get the empty card over there? Is that what I'm supposed to do? The fudge. I am beyond confused. There's a blocker. Wait, block. You can block these nuts. Oh, uh, fuck. Uh, uh, push. What am I doing? I have no, I should have read this. What I was doing. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, restart it real quick. Jesus Christ. Am I supposed to put the yellow where the yellow and the blank is where the blue is supposed to go? Is that what I'm supposed to do? Is that what we're supposed to do? Mm, you're at 49. You haven't watched the first one. Well, maybe we do a movie thon next weekend. Maybe we do it tonight. I don't give a shit. Do something. Do I just end stream right now? We all just go watch anime? Shit. Uh-oh, wait. No. Uh, wait, mistakes were made. No! Push it back! You're down? Okay, listen. That's not how we grow this channel, though. It's not how we grow the channel! Yeah, I don't give a shit. We can go do that if we want. Hey, we did it. Only took me like five attempts. Make sure you guys sign up for a roll. Otherwise, the bot will kick you. Not even, ca not even capping. What units would be good for a silver wolf? Uh, as of right now, the only team that I can see viable is the lightning team. As of right now, the only team I can see viable is the lightning team. Uh, the fudge. Am I supposed to, am I supposed to load this, this piece of crap? Is that what I'm supposed to do? All right. Get over there. Yeah, I said push. So you can do like uh, Kafka, Serval, Bailu, or you can do Bailu, Jing Li, or Jing Yuan, Ting Yun. Load, load the oars. Unload the oars. Fudge! Why is that even an option? Man, I kind of want to watch that movie now. Why'd you, guys, why'd you guys make me want to watch that movie? How dare you? How dare you do this to me? Yay, we did it! Problem solved! Brain hurts! Yes. Nice. One hundo. Alright, cool. Mission down. Next mission. Uh, sure, let's do this one. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah, Silver Wolf really requires uh, you to have a mono element team. And that's why I really don't suggest most people pull for Silver Wolf. Now, I think Silver Wolf will be meta. I think she will be absolutely meta. But I think she will only be meta from a very medium to large spender because you have to have you have to be able to build mono teams and right now it's not easy to build mono teams you think uh kafka would be a good pull if i already have jing yuan as my lightning aoe option uh kafka is kafka is not your main dps champo actually would be uh or well she can be if you serval yeah it's kind of weird right uh, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you there. 
I kind of wish she wasn't lightning. But uh, she she is going to be good. But she does require like shampoo or servo to be good. As of right now. When Yangqing worked well with her because of his uh, talent kit, you get 30% more damage when the enemy has uh, ice weakness. Yeah, but how do you guarantee ice weakness, Trust? So you put what? You put Yang Ching and and uh, Silver Wolf together. What's your other two members you're going to put on that team to guarantee you get ice weakness? Who's Sukuyomi on uh, either Gazer? We just pulled her. Nice. Challenge completed. Gerard and another ice unit? Yeah, so you could do that. If you want to run uh, Gerard uh, and like uh, in March 7th or Pela, you could do that. That is a team. So I'm just trying to get you guys in the, the mindset, right? I'm trying to get you in the mindset that you have to build a mono team. And right now, there's only Lightning and like Ice can do it. But having Japard and Yang Ching is a very beastly ask for most people. You know what I mean? You might be rare that you have her. And you have both of those units. You know what I mean? Like, that's not... Most free-to-play don't have that combination. Most free-to-play don't have Bai Lu to do Lightning, right? What about her relics? Um, as of right now, it doesn't matter what her relics are. She's a pseudo DPS. So you probably just use the quantum set on her until we get a speed set or some shit. You have Zula, but you're not sure about getting Silver Wolf. Yeah, the problem is that you need to build a quantum team. How do you build a quantum team? You can do Zila. You could do... Now, uh, Silver Wolf doesn't count as quantum because her skill doesn't count herself. You have to wait for the new quantum healer. That's a four star that's not here yet. We don't know when she's coming out. It's probably 1.3, 1.4. Um, and then you would have to do uh, Ching Che. And now you could use Ching Che as a support. It's very awkward, but you can use her as a skill builder. So you can make that team possible. But right now, there's not enough quantum characters. Not the break set. No, she doesn't get any bonuses to break, right? Yu Kong would do better with a break set than um, Silver Wolf, right? Does Silver Wolf get any uh, benefits to uh, break efficiency? What the fudge is this? Huh? I don't even know what that is. Yeah, so that's great, right? You could do um, you could do the Quantum Healer, Fu, and Zila with Silver Wolf, right? But that's what I'm saying. But by the time that happens, you might want to pick up Silver Wolf later. And then you have to get Zila plus Fu plus the new healer. So all I'm saying is that Silver Wolf is really hard to build around right now. And uh, yo, Donnie, welcome on in. Silver Wolf is really hard to, uh, to, to, uh, build around. Foo, like F U, right? Like F you. I call her Foo. Because it's a lot easier than saying her whole damn name. Uh, but she's a quantum, uh, tank, technically. Now she's a she's an interesting tank. She doesn't do shielding. She does like max HP increasements. So it'll be really interesting to see where she falls in the meta. Uh, but do you guys get what I'm trying to say? I'm trying to say that Silver Wolf, you're not gonna be able to make an optimal team. Like, you're just not gonna be able to make she is technically a tank, yes. Uh, but she's kind of like a tank, like March 7th's a tank. Um like, if you were to... Uh, let me see if I can find one here. The problem is that, like, if you were to build a balanced team right now... Um, does this have all the characters? 
Okay, cool. Uh, if you were to build like a balanced team right now with uh with Silver Wolf, where is she even? Like what where are these character models, the fudge? So you have Silver Wolf, right? Now you have to build three elements the same, right? So I'm just gonna use it the same. So like how can you do that? You do like you could do a lightning team, right? Which would be like uh uh this would be your healer, right? It would be um Bailu plus uh shit like either Yang Ching or or uh or Kafka plus uh plus like Serval or Ting, right? Uh so you could build this team. This is the lightning team, right? Is a mono quantum team better to be better than uh Branya and Zila? Probably. Probably. Uh, because you got to remember that, um, Silver Wolf's, uh, not only does she apply, uh, weakness, she does defense down or, um, um, elemental damage down. So when she puts the weakness on, say she does, say she does lightning weakness. She also makes the enemy take 20% more damage. Would Losha be a better option? Yes. In my opinion. Claire is amazing. As of right now, if you guys don't have two healers for MOW and you're not in the extreme whale, it's hard to do. So there's not a lot of teams you can build with Silver Wolf, right? You see what I'm saying? So you could also build, you could you could do like Japard plus Yang Ching, uh, plus uh plus uh shit. Um uh, uh what am I thinking? Uh, 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 Pela, that's what I'm thinking. Uh, so you can do this, right? You can do this setup right here, right? So, so there's a frost team and there's a lightning team right now, but there's not really a quantum team. And that's the biggest issue. Now, the quantum team will eventually happen, but you got to pull Fu, you got to have Zila, and then you have the you have to have the new quantum healer that's not on this list. You know what I mean? Now you could probably run this shit or something like I don't know, but. You know, just take the chance that she doesn't do wind resistance down. But the, mo the, the moment she does wind resistance down, it's going to feel super bad, right? It's going to feel super bad. So that's what I mean. Like, Silver Wolf is in a really weird spot. She's probably in the best spot if you're getting Kafka or Jing Yuan. But a lot of people want to use her with uh, Zila. But, you know, here's the problem. People are going to use her with Zila. And you're going to see a lot of clips online when she gets the proper quantum down on the 25% or the 30% chance to uh, to do quantum, right? And you're going to be like, oh my God, she did so much damage. But then you won't see behind the scenes of her missing her quantum down like 50 times in a row, right? And it's only a 75% chance. So it's a 75% chance. Then it's another 33% chance, right? Like, it, it doesn't count herself either. So, like, it's not the... It's like, if you're not building a mono team with her, like, I don't think she's going to work very well. Why I hear that choking all the way from the bathroom? I don't know. Does that make sense, everyone? Like, I think it does, right? And um, I think there's a lot of copium going on right now. Uh, but we have to wait and see. I mean, who sh who knows? Right? We have to wait and see, right? But I hopefully that makes a lot of sense. So if you... Um, if we look at the characters, right? Uh, this Dude, this website sucks. Like, dear God. Like, can you... Can someone re-UI this goddamn website? For the love of... Of holy... Bananas. Um... I think she's going to be great the second rotation. Yes. I think she's going to be great the second rotation. So here's here's her skill, right? There's a 90% base chance to add one weakness of an on-field ally. That means your three other allies. This also reduces the enemy's damage resistance to that weakness type. So I do want to point out, if the enemy is weak to fire and you build a fire team, she will still do weakness of fire and then do the damage resistance to that weakness type by 20% as well. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, maybe it won't. Hold on. No, it won't. I lied.
Whoa, that's kind of weird. Yo, dude, what? That can't be right. That can't be right. Okay, we'll have to see on the final one. If the enemy already has the type weakness, the effect of damage resistance reduction to that weakness type will not be triggered. That doesn't seem right. Weird. Um, okay. That makes her a little bit more niche. Just saying. All right. Anyway, so I digress, but you know what I mean? It's still, it's still one weakness type of an on-field ally, right? So it's kind of weird. Um, but what really makes her cracked is her, um, her ultimate, right? The weakness, the, the, um, the defense down. Like, holy shit. Like, absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. Defense down. Absolutely cracked. So... I don't know, man. Like, guys, I, I don't know. Like, I like I think she'll be fine for Wales. I don't know about free to play. I think I think Locho will get you guys a lot more usability in the long run. Oh, of course. Like, of course she's gonna be super cracked with defense down. Of course. But you know what I mean? Like, if you're gonna pull her for the defense down, fine. But if you're pulling her for the add one weakness of an ally type. You have to build around her, right? And the problem is that Pela has the same thing for cheaper and free. And it's AoE. And it's AoE. This is single target. You know what I mean? Like, Pela can do this better. Yeah, Lucha is better than Natasha. Yes. Um... I think I think she's just niche. I like I think she's a whale's like wet dream. But for everyone else, you're just gonna get bean boozled. To me, she doesn't look like a pull. Or at least not to the second rotation. Isn't the elemental thing in Silver Wolf good in your opinion? No. Unless you can like we just went over it, right? Unless you can build a full team that's a single element. No. Not at all. Right? A lot of people want to bring her with Zila, but how many quantum can you put together with Zila? Nothing. Almost nothing until you guys get Fu and you get the four star healer. So the only team she works on right now is a uh, is a frost team, which requires two five stars, or a volt team that also requires two five stars, or, or at least one five star. You know what I mean? Like it does like guys, am I like is this making sense? This is how I've like this is how I've like come to the conclusion that she's not a must pull as of right now. Now, you will see a lot of cracked out numbers. You guys will see a lot of shorts, a lot of TikToks of people doing some insane damage. We get that. But you could do the same thing in Pel with Pela today, right? If you really wanted to do cracked defense down, you could bring your zeal. You could bring Pella in for your defense down. You could do it today. You know what I mean? Right? When exposed, enemy's defense is reduced by 32% free it's free is ching she bad yes no she's not bad now you could bring you could build ching che two different ways you could build her as a skill point builder which means that she's mainly gonna be doing her auto attack with shuffling cards or you could build her as a damage but if you build her as a damage dealer it does require it does require almost jing yuan's light cone so yeah mm, eh. I don't know. I wouldn't do it. But who knows? We'll we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens, guys. Let me let me ask this question. How far is everyone in MOW? Are you at least three stars, six floors in? Are you at least six floors? Three stars apiece in MOW? What's the what's the biggest problem you guys have in MOW right now? Probably building the second team. Right? 
How many times has your butt clenched so hard from getting getting punched in the face but not having the healer? Yeah, you need the healer. Exactly. 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 You need the healer. Like and if and like if that doesn't scream Locha is a better pull, then yeah, I yeah. I, oh, you know what I mean? Like it's just. I had this argument with another uh, content creator and they're like, no, nah, Silver Wolf is still way better. I was like, yeah, maybe in like a year, right? Like Silver Wolf is like the Mona of Genshin Impact, right? Like no one used Mona for like an entire year until they were all cracked out of their minds and they needed to do even more elite DPS. You know what I mean? Get her later if you want to do that. As of right now, I think she's useless. Not useless, but you know what I mean. How long does it take for Mona to have a rerun banner? Well, she's a standard five pull, so everyone got her eventually. Like, there's probably like a 2% of the population that doesn't own Mona. You know what I mean? Anyways, you guys got me rolling tonight. I, I just want to save you guys some money and I don't think it, I don't think she's really going to help you with MOW. That should be your, you guys should have two questions at all times. Three questions. I'm going to give you the three questions that you should have at all times. Risen, good to see you. One, who are your two primary DPS? If you can't answer that question, you've messed up. Two, who are your, who are your f two complete four man teams? Can you build eight characters into two teams? Right? And three, is this character going to help me progress through MOW? Because that's how you're going to get more gems. Answer all three of those questions and that'll tell you exactly who you need to pull every single time. Balls. Right. If you get Bailu, you're okay? Yeah, 100%. But I think if you have Bailu and Natasha, I don't know if you'd still pull Silver Wolf, in my opinion. I, um... I, I don't know if you would. If you're planning to pull Blade or Jingli, I, I don't know. It's, it's hard to say. You'll have Bailu carry you through the early game? Listen, March 7th could carry you through the early game. That's not really a statement. <laughs> Listen, my, my, like, my Dragon Balls would be able to get you through the early game. What was question four? Is a waifu or husbando? Yeah, sorry guys. Um, this game isn't about the waifus. That's why it's called Honkai Dude Rail. Because you're railing dudes constantly in this game because they're better than the waifus. Not pulling Kafka as a we won. <laughs> Damn, that's sad, right? Honkai Dude Range Simulator. I mean, you can't tell me that by and large, most of the dudes in this game are better than the females. They just are. They just are. You got Locha. You got Blade. You got Jing Yuen. You got Don Hong, right? You've got Japard. You technically got your main MC if you're playing a dude. You know, I mean, they're just they're just typically better. You got Yang Ching. You, know? <laughs> you got Welt. Welt is also good in the late game too. Like, there's just 
There's just so many good options. That it's this is a dude simulator. Yeah, hundred percent. Wait till the mommies come. Uh, listen, we we always, as a gentleman, you always wait for the mommy to come first. Okay, as a gentleman, in a scholar. Silver Wolf looks like a useful long term. Yes. Velocia looks useful short term. No. I don't think so. I don't think that's true. There's not a, there's not another healer that's on par with Losha. There's not another healer yet that's on par with Losha at all. Not even close. Uh, uh, all right. We're almost TL 60. We're so close. So close. Uh oh. Shit, dude. We got. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Do we do one of these? Oh, no. Why? A lot of people are clearing MOC 10 with three stars or wiping uh, out first half using uh, Zila, Branya, Tingyu, and Asta, which doesn't require a healer. Is why I'm a bit more hesitant on watching on wanting Locha. Yeah, so you're, uh, a lot of those are with like Zila and the Light Cone too. What about the people that don't have Zila and that can't get past like stage three? You know what I mean? Like, Yeah, a lot of those are definitely well. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you have you have to have Branya on top of that too, right? So, like, you know, crazy. Um. I don't know if I've seen a E zero Zila clear MOC ten three star. I don't know if I've seen it. I've seen people do it, but I don't think I've seen E0 do it. I've seen like, you know, like E3 Branya with like an E6 Zila, right? Like, you know what I mean? Uh, you know what we could do? We could, we could spend a little energy. Let's do that. Do, 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 do. Not a lot of them. First one. MOC E0 Yangxing E6 Zila. <laughs> I I have not personally seen an E0 Zila clear MOC 10. But that's fine. E30 started with E0 Zila. Oh, does he have a video on it? The only reason you haven't seen whales do it is because you uh, free the play. Everyone yet? I'll look it up later. You'll see free free the play runs. Yeah, that's fine. But like, what? Why does that? Why does that? Like, what? So what's what's the argument you're making here? Are you saying that we should pull Silver Wolf more? Right. And then you're also requiring people to have like a cracked out Ting Yun. Like probably like an E6 Ting Yun. You're also having Branya on top of that, right? You are you saying we should pull Silver Wolf because she will help 
people progress in MOC better? I, I don't think that's the case. I think Locho would help free the play better. You're the one that said you can't clear with E0 Sila. I said I haven't seen anyone do it. I didn't say you can't do it. Uh, 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 Wait, did we hit 60? Oh, God. Wait, how many runs is this? God damn it. All right, let's do a couple more. Yeah, who knows? I mean, who knows, dude? Let's do the companion quest? No, I'd rather do those later. When we're having like a slow night. Will we get enough gems to pull if we did not save? To pull who? Yeah, I don't I don't know like once again uh, uh, to answer the question I have not seen a free to play Yet yeah, just yet So you found a video that's Zila e0 s1 Jing Yu and e0 s1 Which with Branya probably too right and Ting Yun and all that goodness, right? So obviously that's not free to play, but that's okay Crap, can you do three more mother of God Also has Bailu, Branya, Japard, Welts, and Clara. Wait, what? What do you think about uh, Ching Yuan and Blade in the same team? So Jing Yuan can be used as a sub DPS. Uh, ooh, okay. So you could use Blade as a tank. You would need March 7th. Kind of a weird team, right? You could do it. You could definitely do it. Uh, you would have to do like Blade, Locha, March 7th, Jing Yuan. I don't know if I would do it. But that's probably how you would have to do it to, to optimize the damage. I don't know if I would do that. But I think that's how I would build it. Are you kidding me? I need five? Yo, eat my ball sack, dude. Mm. I have a second account with six five star characters and one five star light cone. Holy shit, dude. That's amazing. You should sell that. You probably make like a bajillion dollars. I do not advertise selling anything. I did not say that. All right. Did we do it? Did we do it? TL60. Equilibrium. Oh shit, I forgot we have to do the equilibrium shit. Oh no. Let me record this. You offer tree fitty. Equilibrium. You know, I'll be honest, I'm so sad that, that the deep equilibrium voice doesn't come out every single time you have to hit an equilibrium. Is anyone else sad that that doesn't happen? Equilibrium. 
Like, come on, man. This, that was like the highlight. Like, where is the voice like screaming at me to go do equilibrium? They missed out on a golden opportunity. Golden. All right. How do I do this equilibrium shit? Equilibrium. Can we add you for supports? Sure. If I have space, I don't know if I do. Probably. Trial of the Equilibriums. You may encounter all this bullshit. Eh. We just go in with this team, right? Call it a day. It should be in your head. Maybe they forgot to transfer the sound in your head. Yeah, maybe. Something like that, right? S Slap her in the face! <laughs> Yo, Sora, good to see you. <laughs> well, that was good. Yo, Equilibrium was only hard at TL20. Remember the first Equilibrium? I feel like it smacked the shit out of me. And then every other Equilibrium past that was like a joke. Uh, 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 uh. Wait, Raltar, what happened? Jing Yuan took you 78 for Himiko and then 79. And then another 79? Holy shit, dude. You might as well re roll. Start over. Get a Jing Yuan account. It's not too late. <laughs> if I wanted to get smacked, I, I, I would have done Elden Ring. We did Elden Ring on this channel. I uninstalled that shit so quickly. I. That is not my game. That was not my game. There was a lot of rage and crying. Lots of crying. Specifically. <laughs> Skill issue confirmed. I mean, I'm a Sekiro guy. Like, I could speedrun Sekiro and play that game. I cannot. Uh... Elden Ring is like. It's too slow. And I couldn't do it. And it, it is a skill issue. I will give you that. But it's so slow! Lost the 50 50 the Branya first. GG. I mean, at least you got Branya. Yeah, they attack your. Yeah, they delay every. Yeah, it just totally messes with me, dude. Like in like uh, in Sekiro, right? Like you can time like the dodges and the parries like perfectly because everything's moving like quickly and fluently. But shit, dude. Like, like, dude, like, oh, uh, yeah. Uh. Elder Ring was easy, Gav. Oh yeah, spoken like a true pro. Equilibrium. Nice. Don't we get like one free summon at Equilibrium? Yay, we did it. Getting the Branya is winning like the 50 50. Do we get four free summons? Pog. No, we only got one. You lied to me. And I didn't appreciate that. I only got one. Look at 
Oh, maybe it's three. All right. It is four. I don't know how to count. Mathematics. Hard. All right. $20 says we don't pull shit. Ready? Time for the no shit pulls. Uh. Oh, there's garbage number one. Dun, 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 garbage number two. Oh! Pog! Pog! Dab it. Dab it. Dab it. Let's go. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, uh, uh. Mommy came home. I'm not going to use her, but at least she came home. Pog. Uh, uh, uh. Your luck's insane. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Nada. I mean, I'll take a character I don't own, right? You know what I mean? That's a win. That's a win in the bucket right there. Hmm. Wait, she's sitting down? <gasps> She's sitting down. Stand by. For those of you that have never seen this, Heroes is about to blow your mind. Hold on. Hold on. We're just we're not getting a good angle. There we go. Nailed it. Nailed it. Oh! Oh! Wow! oh! <laughs> what a nice way to start watching yes. your stream. <laughs> what are we looking at right now? Well, we know that she wears black panties. We're kind of looking at her ass off. We can look at her booba too, technically. On the other side. Uh. Yeah, get the you gotta get the angle right. Hmm. Why is her face inside her body? <laughs> Well, now you guys know that trick. If you guys have never figured that one out. Did I just blow your mind? Hopefully I did. Hopefully I did. <laughs> oh, man. That's hilarious. <laughs> and before that's patched out somehow. I don't even know how they would do that. Dev tools here for sure. <laughs> uh, yo, we're now teal 60. What can we do here? Ascension? Ascension! Here we go. Hmm, we have 3 million monies too on top of that. Let's go. Wait, we need. Oh my god. Do, 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 do. What's the benefit of getting teal 60 before reset? Besides uh simulation reward. Uh you shouldn't have done your weeklies. You do your weeklies. You get better resources from your weeklies and shit. Mmm, level 80. Let's go. Mm-hmm. Delicious. Delicious. 
How much does it take to level up? Oh, my dear Lord, that hurts. Oh. 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 Oh, my balls. Mm. 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 Nice. Got 30. Almost 3,600 attack. Holy shit. I might have one of the most cracked out Jing Yoons ever. Holy shit. Can we enhance this too? I need 10 keys. Holy oh, God. All right, hold on. Let's go to his traces real quick. God, dude, we need like a buttload of keys. How many keys can I make? Oh my God, not enough. Oh, dear Lord. You get double gold relic drops at TL60? Yes, you do. All right, we're gonna grab this. Beautiful. Mm, delicious. Mm, crit rate by 10% for two turns. Then we'll grab this too. Need eight of these. Oh my God. Not what I wanted to do. Uh, oh, 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 we can make a buttload. Thank God. Does it give you ascension mats or should I kill? It does, but it only gives you the mats that are farmable, right? You can only farm half of what you need. Huge. You get TL 50 today. Huge. All right, we're gonna grab this. Oh my God. Huge. And we're gonna grab this. Yo, huge. What's that bring our stats to? Holy shit. God damn, my Jing Yun is fat. God damn. God damn, is he fat? We have enough to enhance this too. You get one more key, right? Park. Yo, let's see what it looks like maxed out. Oh, do I have enough to get? I need eight more. Oh my dear Lord. Oh man. That was like all our reasons. I already spent a million dollars on one character. Holy sweet banana phones. Jesus Christ. I spent, I've spent a million two on one character. Oh my God. My balls hurt so much. All right. What's he, what's he look like? What's he looking like right now? Details. Damn. That is a fat. God damn. Jing Yuen. That is a fatness. Woo. Mm. Derpy. The seven months. Thank you. Appreciate you. God damn. Can we ascend her? Oh, I will. oh, I may not have the materials anymore. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. She's really important to ascend. Oh no. Uh. Yo, Derpy. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. She's like super important to ascend. Derpy will this is really needed. Subscribed. D. D's nuts. Yeah, you're right. Hmm. You're using speed boots? Nice. Max by zeal at 70 cap. Who should I work on next supports? Tanks or healers? You shouldn't do you shouldn't do any support past level 60 besides maybe Bronya or Ting Yun. Just because they're so cracked. That should be a video right there. You got Branya or Ting Yun. Those are the only supports you really need to bring to 80. Like Branya skill, amazing. Ting Yun skill, amazing. All right, here's what we gotta do. We gotta we gotta level we gotta level the Shu Shangs. We gotta level the Shu Shangs. That's my other DPS. We gotta get we gotta get her strained away. Time to blow all my money. I'm off by one. Crap. 
Uh, can I steal one from somewhere? Give me that. Oh, I need two? Give me that. Shit. Damn. Why did you make that video? I did Bailu and Nat today. Rep. I think I have did that video on many videos. I think I, I think I make that as a disclaimer for most of my leveling videos that says you should not do this shit. Leave them at 60. Is Losha still worth pulling if you have two healers? Ah, it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell. Um, I think if you have two healers, you have the luxury to, to think about that. Um, you know what I mean? Feels okay, man. Nice. You dropped crit some? Nice. Uh, let's make like 32 of these. All right. Slap it in there. Ascension. Auto add. 138. 138 purple bucks. Holy shit. Holy shit. God damn. God damn, does that f not feel good? Um, traces. Need some of these. Do, 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 do. Ba, ba, do, be, ba. Uh, my balls hurt. Does anyone else's balls hurt? If you're a female out there, you can also say that your balls hurt. It's fine. We're an equal opportunity ball hurting community. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Thank God I farmed some money. Thank God. If you guys have not followed any of my videos where I told you how to level through your TL 50s, and for all the people said that I am dumb for telling you to farm some credits, we just spent over 2.2 million credits on two characters. You can eat a bag of d I was right. You were wrong. Goddamn. Woo. Oh, man, we just we just broke under a million. Shut. I'm ignoring advice on purpose. No, there's people on my video. They're like, you don't need to farm that many credits, Kyrios. It doesn't cost that much money. What are you thinking, you f Like, what? The math. I, I did the math. I, 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 I pulled out the calculator. Do you, wait. All right, well, that's fun times. All right, cool. All right, we got our two primary DPS up to par. Oh, I should level this too. Mm, 200,000 just to ascend it. Oh, oh God. Mm, mm. It, just doesn't, it just doesn't feel right. Uh, do I have the stuff to level her up if I even get her up to 80? So I'm probably gonna get Ting Yuan up to 80. Uh, if you guys didn't know, uh, pro tip, if you guys didn't know, you guys don't need to get Ting Yuan past about 2,500 attack. If you have more than about 2,500 attack, you were effectively kind of messing up. There's been some misinformation out there, but if you guys didn't know, let me, let me, uh, let me straighten the board here for you guys. You're gonna see that she has this ability, right? Increases their attack by 35% up to 19% of the current attack, right? What that means, and it's only based off the base attack plus base light cone. So what that means is when this is fully maxed out, it's like somewhere around like 55%. So if you take someone like Zila, right? You take, or you take like any character, and you take their base stats, right? Their base stats would be 1280. Then you add the light cone into that. So it becomes... It becomes like, I don't, I don't remember how that happens there. Um, or it's part of the light cone. So you only need, you only need to get 55% of their base stats put together. Oh yeah. Light cone plus, uh, plus base stats gets you to 2,500, right? So like, that's, that's all you really need to do. 
You don't need to get it that cracked off. It's like Bennett, right? I forgot how to do that. I, I have the math written down on the spreadsheet. But essentially, the breaking point for her is you get her to about 2,500 attack. You don't need to get any more. I really wish they used base attack. Oh, yeah, dude, the wording on this is terrible. Absolutely terrible. Want oh, some of your relics, luck too? Yeah, hell yeah. You would smash some Honkai Star Bennett? Jesus. All right. Uh. That was painful. Next character we're probably going to level is the main MC. Because you get all the Ascension materials for free. I don't want to spend the money right now. So we're not going to. Um, And then I'll probably level up Ting Yu and then Branya. And then that will probably be all the 80s I do for a very long time. Do I have enough to get Ting up? So this, this is really important to Ting Yun. Immediately regenerates five energy at the start of her turn. This fixes her energy awkwardness. Has anyone used Ting Yun and you've been like a butt crack hair away from the ultimate? Like, like you know what I mean? Like it's like 95% of the way there. And you're like, God damn, this sucks. This fixes that problem. That's why it's so important to get her to 80. Two point five thousand defense. I had three thousand defense. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This fixes the problem. That's why it's really important to her. Hey, have you guys seen how fast my uh, Ting Yun is? You guys like that? You guys, you guys. Mm, is that delicious? You have 1.6 thousand defense. Yep, devs ain't dumb. Alright, do we um do we try to ascend her and get her trace? Or do we go do some stimulation universe? She needs all that speed to keep up with the fluffy tail safe. That's right. Uh you want her to be as fast as possible because you want her to be able to generate as much energy as possible. Speed. Once you get the attack break line, which is around 2500, she'll get it. You know, because I haven't leveled up my light cone. Um, once you hit that, right? That's where she's at. Mm -hmm. How fast is Ting with the Asta buff and her own yes. speed buff? She gets a 20% speed buff. Uh, with Asta and her own speed buff, I think I get her up to like 220, 230. Somewhere around there. All right, what are we doing here? Uh... You know what? I'm going to spend some energy. You guys want to test some things out real quick? I want to test some things out. I'm going to see how everything's looking. So we're going to do some stimulation universe. Since we just got the new tier of world six. Um, we don't need to do this one. We will. Let's try some of this. I need some of these. I want to try one of these. So let's try one of these too. Um, oh, and we can do our weeklies as well. Okay, cool. So we can test out all the new shit we get. And then we can test out a dungeon too. Um, oh, for everyone farming for Blades gear, it's been leaked that there's a new set. There's a new speed set and HP set coming out. So I wouldn't overly farm uh, Blades gear as of right now because it looks like you're not going to use this set. As an FYI. Can you solo Kokolia with your Jing? Solo it? No. Like, can I do it? Yeah. Um. All right. Let's let's see how this let's see how this plays out a little bit. What's the best set for Welt? Uh. Probably this one right here, right? 
his own the the, the standard set all right let's do this in order let's do let's do a couple of these and see if we get any better rates yeah speed and hp set i'm gonna share it to my twitter later tonight so if you guys uh haven't followed my twitter follow my twitter there's been a leak about the two new sets coming out we don't know if it's if it's accurate but i'm gonna i'm gonna post it to my twitter later let's do th let's do six runs You think Yukong's worth it? No. Um, we've already reviewed Yukong. Uh, we've seen it from the beta test on YouTube. Uh, she is going to be very awkward to use. Uh, you're going to have to completely speed tune her. And um, she requires Eidolons. 100%. 100%. So is she great? I think she's going to be absolutely cracked. Um, but I don't think she's going to be cracked at E0. And I don't think she's going to be cracked unless you can 100% speed tune her properly to the team you put her in. So that's kind of hard to, you know, digest. You're hoping Jing Louis is a good character? Me too, man. Ow. Oof. Ooh, feels good. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. What does his crit look like now? So he's got the 10% uh, crit rate buff now. Oh my God. This all looks beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Rocking a solid, a solid 4,700 attack. 81% crit rate. God damn. I have never been more turned on in my life. God damn. That's amazing. <laughs> I've already changed my pants twice. Oh, my dear Lord. Oh, my dear Lord. This man's doing damage. Uh, uh. How does your jig hit for sixty one thousand without buffs? I have over four I have almost four thousand base attack. My Jing is one of the best Jings I've seen out there for a non-whale. For I, I think I have, I honestly think I have the best geared E zero Jing I've ever seen out of all uh, all of all of the screenshots I've ever seen. Can it get better? It can, but it's really good right now. Uh, man, I want Jing Lee so badly. And that's the only reason I think I need to pull Locha. Because if we've seen the leaks of Jing Lee, and her skill in Ultimate had something funky. The wording on it, which it was just a leak, but the wording on it said sacrifices the health of your teammates in order to enhance your damage. So. She has a mechanic where she sucks the life force out of your three other teammates. So I have this really weird feeling that she's going to absolutely need Locha and you're going to have to like super focus build around her, which I love build types like that. Let, let me just build into that mommy right now. Hmm. Was there a, a percentage value? I don't recall there being a percentage value, but probably. 
Yo, Zach, we'll come on in, dude. <laughs> Copium. I have a really, I have a really crack, Jingyun. Uh, Hanabi? I haven't seen Hanabi yet. Yo! That's that's an improvement. Not that big of an improvement, but we got two. I've never gotten two in a six rotation. Not that big of an improvement, but it is an improvement. You can hide behind this calyx if you didn't know. Pro tip. Yeah, if you guys want to see by Jing Yun again, here's the stats. Uh, yes, Blade, Locha, Jing Li is kind of what I'm going after right now. I think so. Speed, speed of Jing, not uh, not good. Technically, in in the parses, speed is better. Technically, in parsing, speed is better. But in practicality, I have never seen speed be better on Jing uh, on Jing Yuan as of right now. Maybe later. That's why I don't always trust parsing. Practicality is a very important thing. Yo, Commander, welcome on in, buddy. All right, what's next up on the list of tests? So we got slightly better. Hey, uh, for everyone on my, um, if you're watching my live stream and for everyone that shat on my video that said you shouldn't do relics until TL60, for everyone for everyone that said you're guaranteed to get a purple, uh, sorry, not relics, a purple, uh, whatever these things are called, Jesus Christ, um, uh, trace material, you guys were all sniffing some goddamn hopium. Every single last one of you. A curios is guaranteed to get a purple every single time. No, it's not. Nope. I don't know. I don't know who told you that, but nope, that's not true. Nope. Nope. All right, so we should get five here now. That's not one of these. We're blowing some bottles, testing some things. Sniff. Uh. Should I bring in my um? Should I bring in my B team? Bring in the B team. Do 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 do. Baba do beep. No, there was, yeah, it was, it was more the fact that people were commenting on my video. They're like, Kiro, that's very wrong advice. If you trace farm at TL60, you're guaranteed to get purples every single time. I was like, what the fudge? Whoever told you that is obviously a goddamn liar. Time to save for that Kafka. Nice. Not bad damage. Nice. Big hit. Not too bad by the shoe shanks. Like what I'm seeing right now. Oh yeah, 100%, right? 100%. Do, 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 do. Yo, Japarts. Going down. Uh, looks like a nice price tag, does it? 
I think it does, you're right. I need to really work on my healing gear. I heal for nothing. Up, oh, can't use skills? Like that. Nice. Woo! Shusheng. God damn, Shusheng. I'm liking I'm liking the Shusheng. Hmm. Need to need to work her up. So we do get five now. Okay, so that's cool. We get five there. Yeah, the E5. Oh man, mine's E5 too. I wish I can get her to E6. All right, so we get five there. So we get slightly better traces. We get five guaranteed. We knew that. Uh, let's test out the gear. Let's test out the gear. Let's do. Um... Yeah, let's test. Let's test out a, a gear real quick. We should be getting double gear drops now. On the new difficulty. Your GF's account got E6 Shusheng. Nice. It's amazing. Uh, but zero Ting Yun? Oh no. Yo, stop attack buffing my Jabardi. All right, so we're TL60 now. We're hoping for two gold drops now. Tayo said Japard carry, right? Exactly. Whew. Oh, we're all taunted. Yo, Kitra, welcome back. God damn, does he hit good. Woo, does he hit good. Nice. Yes. We're testing the TL60 uh, stuff for drops. Oh, we do get two pieces of gold gear. Nice. Dog shit. Dog shit. But we do get two pieces of gold gear. Nice. Nice. All right. So that another another thing tested. Uh, next test. Uh, we should get now two gold gears on these. Do we test uh do we test a weekly? Or do we go test some stimulation universe? Hmm. Hmm. How much of those mats? It should be for the five, I think. I think it's random a little bit. Um Did I strip most of our gear though? I think I did. Uh, 
I think I stripped her. Oh boy. Um. It's two to the four. Is it really? Jesus. Uh, all right, let's. Yes, we try this. She's too squishy. She'll be fine. I should have brought the fire MC. I don't know why I didn't. Yo, look at that fat break. Jesus. Woo, Ting Yoon. Calm down. I mean, not Ting Yoon. Jesus, uh, Shushang. Did you max stamina every day? Every day. Except for the first like four days. Uh oh. Do 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 do. I use uh Zealus. But I was using uh crushing sky before. Instead of pulling Zeal, I decided to get her a light cone. Stop punching me in the face, please. Oh, yeah, there's no way I'm going to use Ching Chi, though, or Ching Chi, uh, Ching Chi. I should have brought that. Why did I bring the fire MC? And I don't know why I didn't do that. Mistakes that were made. And this guy's got a lot more life. Jesus. Fire MC would have been done already. Yeah, I know, right? Should have done it. If you're wondering why I'm attacking the one that has no shields, because I get all my skill points back. Ouch. <laughs> Zach, welcome back. 209,000 damage on the Shushang? That's pretty good. God, that was, that was a fat chicken. That was a fat chicken. We'll take that. 
That was a massive what the God damn that felt good Oh boy Nice break. Got to take down the middle. Otherwise, it starts like something shit on your on your face. What? No crit. Oh man, that felt bad. Is he all 60 the max right now? 65, I think. Maybe 70. I can't remember. <laughs> nice. Uh, uh, uh. Yo, calm down, please. Yeah, that's right. 70s max. Good job. Kuru spin. He's got that emote. I should I pick Flara? You recently got her. Uh, attacky. Like as much attack as possible. Here we go. You need March 7th, also. Uh, well, this was a slow fight, but it was a, uh, you know, typical. Yeah, you gotta use March 7th with Clara. Otherwise, not gonna be good. Come on. Nice. All right, three. We had double double gold guarantee though. Attack, defense, break effect, HP, HP percent. Well, this is actually pretty good. Holy shit. Uh, hello. Wow. I'll take that. All right, well, so that's good to know. All right, let's go. Let's go try the stimulation universe real quick. What time is it? Okay. We should be able to do world six tier three now, I think. Yep. 
Yeah, tier three, world six. Technically, I have world five to do as well. Some free shit. But we'll do that one later. Dun, dun, dun. Get in there. All right, here we go. Uh, that, that, and that. Ew, World 5. I know, like, no one... It, I mean, World is okay, but, you know, no one farms World 4. Like, World 4 is the true EU. Can characters get to level 90? As of right now, no. Maybe later. You're TL 49, should I start farming gear at TL 50? You should farm enough gear for your primary DPS. Or to feel good enough to do shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> we'll talk about World 4? Yeah, 100%. God, my team unit is fast. All right. Good start. Good start. We already have our buff. Out the gate. Uh, uh. Mm -mm -mm. Hacks, one hundred percent hacks. Ouch. How dare you? Your team Shusheng, Natasha, Marcev, and Clara? No. Can't put Shusheng and Clara together. You little, uh, well, I mean, you can, but like, you're, uh, well, you, that team would work. Uh, you just couldn't always skill with Shusheng unless you've got like an E1 and E6 Shusheng. Uh, uh. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about it. Um, you gotta digest that one a little bit. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, it's a little bit skill hungry. It's yeah, it's it's too skill hungry for my liking. Ouch. Should I farm gear for the other characters at TL50? No, I would be very careful f overly farming gear in your TL50s. I have videos completely on this whole land. Uh, just check out some of my uh, what the farm from TL, uh, you know, uh, TL uh, 50 to uh, 60. I got some videos on it. Oh, yeah. I guess that. He's got TL40. I don't know what the grind. Um, probably EXP and stuff. Uh, TL30s and 40s, you're mainly going to get gear from the Stimulation Universe. Uh, you can do a little bit of gear farming in your TL40s and 50s, guys, but you can't overly do it. You'll have to do a little bit of trade. You're going to do a little bit of everything in your TL40s. You're, you're focusing on leveling right now. Uh oh. Leveling is your key priority till TL60. But you will need some gear, you know what I mean? 
Like, once you guys can gear your two primary two DPS, like, don't don't worry too much about everything else. Hi, Mo. Like, get a little bit of gear for everyone else, but you'll mainly get through simulated universe. Ooh. Oh man, these all suck. Um God. Oh my god. What is happening right now? Is that till 50? Any tips on what to focus on first? I have a whole video on Panda. If you haven't seen my video, I tell you exactly what to, to farm from TL 50 to 60. Um, you'll do a little bit of gear from 50 to 52. You'll do, uh, um, or for 50 to 53. And then from there, you're going to need to do some calculations on how many, uh, purple books you'll need with how much money you need. I just leveled two characters from 70 to 80. It cost me two point three million credits and uh 270 purple books um and then you'll do you'll do trace farming so once you get enough of that that'll be from like teal 53 to 60 you'll do trace farming from like 57 to 59 so uh check out my youtube channel <laughs> how do you get so many credits i farmed them like like if you guys didn't know like I've been I've been helping you guys out every step of the way. Like I have I have Honkai Star Rail videos. Like avoid these late game mistakes. TL50, mistakes in how to farm correctly. This tells you how to farm from 50 to 60. Right? I have calculators on um uh farming correctly at your TL 40s and how to prepare for TL50. Um I've cal I've got calculators for your TL 30s going into TL40. So I've done a lot of videos on how you guys can um, take it, like put into some spreadsheets and shit. Um, I haven't done the one for TL60 yet because we just hit it. But God damn it. I hate, I, I hate that they put this goddamn... Shut up, Kyrios! Shut the f*** up! Goddamn YouTube putting this goddamn back button while I was trying to hit the pause button. But anyways, like, so like I've built like, I've built these calculators and shit um, that you guys can use. Dear mother of baby goddamn Jesus, what the hell is wrong with my internet right now? Uh, that you can use to uh, plan out all your shit at every step of the way. So, check out my YouTube channel. A lot of the people are going to be in trouble. A lot of, lot of people are going to be in trouble. We got the we got the worst one. You regret nothing? No, my my biggest regret is that we we don't have enough influence to reach the people that matter. There's so many people leveling right now that have spent so much energy, like they've over farmed gear, they didn't farm gear properly, they've either under farmed traces or they've over farmed traces, they've under farmed the amount of EXP books they made, they don't have enough credits, shit like that. And if you would have seen my videos, I would have told you, hey, at, at TL53, start calculating how much you need. Go break off for the next TLs. Go do this, right? Get a little bit of gear at TL51, 52, right? At your TL20s and 30s, you should be in the simulated universe, getting that gold gear there, not really farming gold gear anywhere else, right? Farming up your materials you need here, right? Doing that, doing like, you know, that's my biggest regret is I can't, I can't reach enough people to get them the right information so that they can hit TL60 like me and be completely ready to go. You know what I mean? Who needs an energy rope more? Brawny or Ting Yun? Ting Yun does not use an energy rope. You have to hit 2,500 attack on Ting Yun. Brawny would be the, would be who I would say. Lots of Shusheng versus Don, uh, Hang versus a main DPS. It depends on the Eidolons. Uh, Don Hung is better than Shusheng. 
um, on paper. Uh, but if you like pulled for Jing Yuan and you've got like an E5 Shu Shang, your Shu Shang is going to do a lot better, right? And the reason I leveled Shu Shang instead of Don Hung is I'm going to be pulling Blade. And Blade's going to replace Don Hung. So I already have my three primary DPS because I already knew who I was going to pull in the future. Is attack by a spear not enough? Nope. It is not. You gotta, you gotta hit 2,500 attacks somehow. Otherwise, you're you're missing damage. <laughs> you get Yang Xing yet? No. <laughs> I have not spent money to pull yet, guys. I've only spent money to um, refresh my energy so I can get you guys videos. That's right. I've spent like $100 refreshing my energy so I can get progressed up fast enough so I can get you guys the videos. Like tomorrow, I'm going to work on my TL60 guide with a calculator to make sure you guys are prepared. So in addition to the video I've already done about the TL50s, I'm going to have a calculator video tomorrow that talks about how you can prepare and how much stuff you need because i needed those numbers i need those metrics and that's why we're recording tonight is the exp books bundled the shop worth it i mean if you're gonna spend money i mean of course it's gonna be worth it but i haven't done it i don't think it's worth it i think the only one that's worth it in my opinion is the um is the uh is the fuel the fuel one every week in my opinion I think we're guaranteed to get two drops now. Oh, man. Man, dude. Wrong set, bro. Wrong set, dude. Man, fuck. Oh, my balls. HP, though. Wrong. Wrong. Wrong stats as well. Uh, anyways. If you guys ever want to share my videos with your friends or to your communities or stuff like that, that would go a long way into making sure that we play a lot of different gacha games. My goal is to help out free to play as much as humanly possible. I almost never tell you to pull. You have to pull anything unless it's like game changing the free to play. Um, I do not believe in whaling. I do believe in spending. You can't spend some money. If you're going to spend money, spend money, like play your money where you want to. But I don't believe in people going bankrupt to play a gacha game. So I tried to make all my videos free to play friendly. Um, as free to play friendly as I can, that is. Uh, who am I bringing in here? Uh -uh. Nice. Do we XP? Uh, all right, answer that one. Anyways, uh, exclamation point YouTube if you guys want to check out my YouTube channel. Um. Uh, oh God, these suck. I mean, I guess I'll take this because I haven't gotten it before. I guess that's kind of cool. Uh, yep, this please. Yo, he almost hit me. Oh my god. Clara March Nat. Uh, Ting Yun, Branya, Asta. Pela. You have a lot of choices.
Error code has been fixed. Isn't that amazing? This doesn't feel that much harder. How did I just take damage there? The fuck? Oh yeah, right. Mm. Yo, huge. Holy shit. Yeah, Branya E1. Oh yeah, 100% Branya. Good team. Uh, there's a crit right. Refresh. Hmm. So close. Um. Do I sub, uh, do I sub Branya out here? Eh, probably not, right? All right, let's just keep going. Yo, dude, you were getting you were getting mucked up. Absolutely mucked. Are you using attack orb? Yeah, I am. Nice. Uh, ooh. Um. Too late in the game for the other two. Let's see what we got here. HP percent terrible. Break effect terrible. Still looking for an attack piece, one of those. Game does not want to give it to me. Game does not want to give it to me. Sadly. Uh, uh. Nice. Transaction. We got here. All characters lose HP exchange for one blessing. Sure, why not? Do 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 do. What we got here? Uh, all right, cool. What do you think of the silver wolf? 
Zela combo? Um, I think it's pretty trash right now. Now, I do want to preference saying that is that Silver Wolf plus Zela is probably going to do some really insane damage. But the synergy is not there yet until you can build a full quantum team. You should watch my newest video where I kind of go over that a little bit. You finished Zelda already? No. Ouch. <laughs> nice. Whoa! God damn. That was hot. That was like all my health back too. Hello? I don't know what light cone to use on Clara. Uh, the one out of the herd of shop is pretty decent, but if you don't have the one from her specific one, that is right. Uh, whoa, whole oh, baby game is like you are going to dominate this round. Oh, baby, that is amazing. Is Dance Dance good on her? On who? On Clara? No. Wait, well, Dance Dance is a... What? Is, wouldn't work on her anyways. Who were you talking about? Yeah, hold on. I can, I can answer. I can't look at all the light cones right now because I can't hit escape and go to my menu. Um, hold on. We got to sub out. We got to sub out Branya. Put in the Jupards. Yeah, I um I'm I'm not sold on Silver Wolf right now, guys. Sadly. Touch. <laughs> Does the title refer to Silver Wolf's nerfs or bad banner? Um, it, it refers to, I don't think she's going to be good for free to play or light spenders. Um, if you've seen my latest video, uh, Strange, Silver Wolf requires you to effectively make a mono team. And the only team you can make right now that's balanced, that's mono, is either Frost or Volt or Thunder. So... I um it, like it, she's gonna be great. She's gonna be amazing, but unless you can make a mono team, technically Pela is better. And I think that's why people are gonna get burnt. That I think she's gonna be better on the second banner and not the first banner. Like she's gonna make you do crack damage. Don't get me wrong. But I I just I feel like if you don't have like a, a repertoire of characters, it's just not it's just not going to work out. And I feel like. I feel like everywhere I see people are like, they're like, oh my God, pull the silver wolf. Do it. It's going to be amazing. And then you're going to have all these people pull it and quit the game because it's not really going to help any of their teams. And I'm, I'm just so afraid of that for free to play light spenders for all the whales pull it right. Like hundred percent. But, um, I'm just, I don't think she's good now. I think she'll be good later. 
she reminds me a lot of like Mona, right? Where Mona was dog shit in the beginning of the game and became better later once we had all these different characters. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, dude. Like I like like I wish I could like just go strangle everyone right now and just get them on the same page and be like, do not suggest Silver Wolf the free to play. It is not going to help them. I mean, whales pull everything. Yeah, that's why I don't talk to whales typically, but hmm, not going to help you. It is not going to help you. Read the skill. Can't pull from any ally. Means you need to make mono team. You've been building Ching Che as what? As a uh, as a skill builder or as, as a DPS? Those are two different ways you can build her. Nice. Yo! Fat. Is this difficulty three, four? Oh man, I was hoping that push her over. Balls. How do I want to do this? Nice. Yeah. I built Pella and Yang Xing until uh, Mommy Kafka. Yeah, and like, honestly, honestly, Mommy Kafka works really great with uh, Silver Wolf. Like, you could do Kafka, Serval, Bailu, and Silver Wolf. But I mean, that's the problem, right? That's the problem. Where do I still have that? Do I still have that um that board pulled up? That's the problem, right? We went over this earlier. The biggest problem is what you're seeing, right? Like, if you want to build her, right? Here's your here's your Thunder team, right? You got to have some combination of this team to put her in there, right? That's a lot of five stars to ask for, kind of, right? Here's your Frost team, and only the only way to make the Frost team work is you got to have Yang Ching and Japard. I mean, you could do March seventh in there too, but like, you know, what I mean, like, mm, uh, mm, mm, where's my March seventh? There she is, right? Like, you could you have to do some combination of that, but you really need. Like you would really need Yang Ching and Japard. Now, what most people are pulling her for is to put her with Zila. There's no one else to put with Zila. Now you could, you could technically put Ching Che, Ching Chi. Okay, I, I, I always mispronounce her name. But then you have to build her as a skill point builder. So you have to build her as a support instead of a damage dealer. So that you're not using her skills, so you can generate skill points for your other two characters. That feels really bad. But at the same time, you'll have to put like Natasha in there. That means like Silver Wolf will occasionally just do like Natasha weaknesses, right? And that's just that's just a shitty team. That's just an insanely shitty team. So most people are gonna be like, all oh, right, here's what I want. I want, I want, I want the Zila plus Silver Wolf plus my Branya plus my uh 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 uh, uh, uh Ting Yun, right? And and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna record I'm going to record when I get that 33% chance for it to land on quantum damage. And then I'm going to make a short about it. You're going to see like 3 billion damage come out of it. And everyone's going to lose their goddamn mind thinking they have to pull her when you can't typically do that. Right. Cause it's like, you know, it's just the statistics aren't there. Like, you know, it's just, I'm just so afraid for the free to play community right now. It's just, you people are going to get beam boozled real hard. <laughs> What about Clara, Shushang, Nat, Silver Wolf? Yeah, you could do that, but it's too skill point hungry, right? Silver Wolf has to do her skill every other turn. 
Chu Sheng has to skill effectively every turn. Clara has to skill effectively every turn. So, like, where do you generate skill points? It's too skill point hungry. It's not a balanced team. Like, at, at that point, like, Xu Sheng will just be sitting there with her thumb up her butt, just doing cues, which kind of sucks. You know what I mean? That's how the RNG to hit the debuff. Yeah, and then you need like, and then everyone's like, oh, but Silver Wolf's gonna do so much damage. They're like, oh, Silver Wolf's gonna do so much damage. I was like, do you realize you have to build like 70 effect hit on her? So her chest piece is probably going to be effect hit. Like, I hope everyone realizes that the chest piece is going to be effect hit. You got to build her speed on her boots. Where are you going to get the damage from? You know what I mean? Like, it's just not going to happen. Like, everyone's like, oh, she's going to do so much damage. And it's just not going to happen. Like, her mod, her, her, um, her skill modifier on her ultimate is pretty huge. Like, don't get me wrong, but it's not that huge. <laughs> you think Clara would be the generator in that build? So you, you don't want to skill with Clara? Uh, okay, I don't have Clara, but that doesn't sound right to me. Like maybe, like like Nat and Clara is your skill builder and then you Shusheng dump with Silver Wolf? Yeah, it's like yeah, you might as well not use her, right? Because then you have a skill with March seventh. Oh, then you have March seventh. You can't do Clara without March seventh. Oh god, that's just complete. You might as well bench her at that point. No, 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 that team doesn't work. No, <laughs> yeah, no, no. Yeah, that's a that's a that's a no go. Yeah. <laughs> I like the thought process though. Clara's a pseudo tank. Has a base increase uh of hit chance. No, she's like destruction, dude. What's destruction? 120 100? 125? Right? Like, like one, 125 plus 75 plus se plus 100 plus Silver Wolf, that's the Hillity plus another 100 is still not that, like, mathematically speaking, that's not right. You know what I mean? Inner traces increase his chance. Oh, man, dude, that's, that's copium, dude. That's that 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 is copium to me. I mean, do, do the team. I mean, I don't. I mean, if you if you are adamant that you love that team, do it. I I wouldn't do it. There's a lot of bosses that aren't physical weak. Well, Silver Wolf would be in that team when you make a mono team, so that doesn't matter. So I get, I get the thought process, right? Nah, I, I wouldn't do it, man. I, I wouldn't do it. 
I don't think it's good. But what's gonna happen is that you're gonna you're gonna rely on Clara to get hit, and what's gonna end up happening is your Shushang's gonna get punched in the like five like four times in a row, do the RNG, and then just die. Right? You know what I mean? Like it's just it's gonna happen. Like shit, dude. My Japard doesn't get hit all the time, and my Japard has uh 150 plus 100 plus 100. So it's like it's got like 350 and still doesn't get hit all the time. Are you gonna pull for low chop? Probably. Oh my god, no ace. This is actually good for um this might be good for blade. I'll keep that. Still no attack set. Still no attack set. That was a good run. Did I say that was difficulty four? I meant it was difficulty three. But yeah. Yo, where's my free shit? Did they, did they give it to me already? Sorry, it's in my inventory. What do we get? Uh, uh, uh. Doesn't Clara's all to 400% aggro? I think it does increased aggro. I don't know what the number is. I mean, like, your Clara's gonna get hit more. Being destruction with the way her toolkit works. I'm just saying, without the increased chance from March 7th, what we've typically seen is without March 7th, you can't really guarantee the hits on Clara. That, like, sometimes the boss will just completely dive into one of your other characters and just foobar the, the, the living hell out of them. Where do you check hit chance? It's under stats. Are you talking about effect hit chance? Like this. Like this right here. Effect hit rate. Tiro is flexing all his uh, light cones. Uh huh. I pulled this on a 10 pull. I pulled this on a 20 pull. You get this for free. We got this from just general banner summoning. We got this from just buying it from the shop. And we got this from general banner summoning. I mean, shit, I haven't, I haven't really done that many general banner summons. How many are we at now? 200. Almost there. Is secret vow good for Clara? Let me look here. Uh, you're at 153 for the general banner. Yeah, I've spent a little bit extra, right? Like, whenever we had like six or seven pulls, I would just round it to 10. You know, so I've spent a little bit. Um, what am I looking for? Destruction. Uh,. I mean, if you're really into Clara and you don't have Claras, like you should probably, if you're really into this, into Clara, like, and you really want to make Clara work, you should probably have picked up one copy from the Herda shop. Right? Um, Ching, welcome on in. Um, and then I'd probably do a secret vow. Secret vow is better. Secret vow is actually pretty correct. 
Yeah. Secret Vow. If you had to do a four star, it'd probably be that one. Yeah. That's what I would use. Arlen OP. All right, let's see if we can get an attack piece here. Recommended team level, level 76. All right, one more run and then we'll figure out what else we're doing. Which uh, battle pass LCG use? Uh, Carve the Moon. It's uh, considered to be the best one. Because you typically have a lot of harmony characters, so you're probably going to have to run like three or four harmony artifacts at any given time. Clara, MC, Yang Ching, Natasha. Like what you do, you put your tank MC next to your Clara to try and get her more cleave damage. I don't know if I would do that. Uh, I would do March 7th. Clara, Yang Ching. It's a little skill heavy though. It's a little skill hungry. That's the problem you guys are gonna run into. You gotta look at your differential. Right, if you guys uh have you guys seen my skill building or my um my team building video, guys check out my YouTube channel. I have a, I have a team building channel uh video I did about three weeks ago. But the problem you run into, right, is um the problem you run into is you really need to figure out how you're going to build a team, right? So say, for example, I have, um, I don't know. Say I did like Zila plus, uh, shit. I don't even know, dudes. Uh, Ting Yoon plus, uh, Silver Wolf plus, uh, uh, I don't know, Natasha, right? What would be a good, what would be a good, What's what's the team you're looking at? Let me do your team here. So you want to do Clara. Why can I not? Why are these not in alpha? They are in alphabetic order. Clara, you want to do Fire MC. Um, Ying Ching. And Natasha. So the issue you're going to run into in this team, right? Is that say, for example, we, we always do it in 10 cycles. The problem you're going to run into is that we know that, you know, the fire trailblazer is going to taunt every other turn or something like that. And if you're not taunted with the fire trailblazer, there's no reason to bring her. You know what I mean? There's no, you might as well bring Japard where, you know, you don't scale. Uh, Yang Ching is not going to do any basic attacks is always going to scale because you want optimal damage out of them. Natasha is probably going to do a skill every two turns or sorry, every, you know, twice in 10 runs, right? And then Clara, the big problem with Clara is that, I don't know, guys, you guys, for the Clara mains out there, I mean, typically you want to skill almost every single time with Clara, but we could say, we could say some shit like this, right? We could do like, uh, I don't know, half and half, right? The problem is that if you're, you have to reduce the amount of skills you do on Clara in order to get a positive differential. And that's assuming you don't have to heal a lot, right? So... Is Clara even worth it at that point if she's not scaling every turn? You know what I mean? Because Clara's whole kit is getting hit, getting stacks, and skilling and doing a buttload of damage. So that's the problem you run into, right? So if you're building this team, right, this shit doesn't make sense, right? How are you going to get 10 more skill points over 10 cycles? There's no way to do it. The only other way to do it, right, is that you have to remove the fire MC. Maybe you put someone like Jappard in that doesn't actually skill. Does basic attacks, right? And um uh do this two eight, right? Um and then you could you could figure it out, right? Then we do ten here, right? Ten and set zero, ten. I don't know why sometimes it doesn't let me do ten. What the fudge? This skill point calculator's got some weird stuff. But you could do a team like this, right? This would work out. You know what I mean? But you have to get, you have to make sure that Clara's getting hit, which is hard to do without March 7th. So then you put March 7th back in there, right? And you're like, all right, well, let me put March 7th, even though she has a higher chance to get hit. Uh, but then March 7th needs to what? Skill what? Like four times in 10 cycles? Some shit like that, right? 
Then you got eight, two, nine, nine. Like, where, where are you gonna get the other seven skill points from? You know what I mean? Um, and it, this doesn't make sense. I don't know why it's saying two points. There's something wrong with this calculator, but you know what I mean? You just have to, you have to balance your load. You have to make sure that you're like, you're dropping your load properly. Claire's skill is not that important. Wait, Claire's skill is not that important. Does more damage in is not game changing and mechanic changing. What? I have, listen, you are the, Nicholas, you are the only person that's ever said that you've never used Clara's skill. Am I crazy? Mm -hmm. That's her, that's like, that's like the, that's her whole kit. Her whole kit is being able to, to use those buffs that you get from having Sfarog. Like, what, what, what's the point of bringing her then? If she's just there to auto attack. You might as well just bring like a proper tank. Yeah. Like, how are you applying Mark? Exactly. Most of clear, Claire's damage comes from the counter, right? But it comes from the counter with Mark. How are you getting Mark if you're not scaling? <laughs> right, well, reverse, reverse, right. Removes Mark, yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I meant, but it's still a lot of damage, right? Um, we'd have to run it through the calculator. I just, I just don't get the point of bringing her if you're not going to skill with her. Like, like there's no, there's no way she's doing like that good of damage without skilling. Because you gotta remember, like Clara's single target damage is goddamn terrible. So you're bringing her for AOE, and a lot of the AOE is coming from skilling. I don't, I don't know. Whatever. I just, if it works, it works. Just do it. It's just my two cents. I wouldn't do it. I can't think. Of, my brain hurts thinking about it. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah. Like... Like if you bring Clara into a boss fight, like she does, she does nothing. So if like you're not skilling on top of that, she literally does nothing. So what's the point of her being in your team? And you're getting the skill to take out AOE waves. And that's the only reason you would bring her. I just... Hmm. I mean, try it. I mean, if it works, it works. Who cares, right? Who cares what I say? If it works, it works, right? That's all that matters. Uh, uh, 
my uh, my only concern with that team is that like you're gonna go up against someone like Kakolia, and then she's gonna for some reason not target your Clara, and uh, she'll just go right into your Shusheng and like two shot her. So that's why you typically bring a tank that has higher aggro, like a lot higher aggro. I also don't know how much aggro the her alt actually provides because there's no statistical number. Yo, Cat Sora, what's going on? Doing good. We're just theory crafting over here, running some things through the old brain. Just use Shusheng and pretend she's Zila. Oh, dude, I love Shusheng. Shusheng, good. Yeah. Your part isn't real. Looks like Jing is treating you well. Yes. Yes, he is. Claire's alt gives 500% aggro. All right, well, we'll just say I'm wrong. Just run, run, Shusheng, Natasha, Silver Wolf, and Clara, and have a good day. I don't, I don't know what you want me to say. I have, uh, I have never seen a solo Clara just take every hit in the game. So, I, like, I, like, I don't know what to say. Like, you're, you're saying she can do it. I haven't seen it happen, so I think you should try it. You should make a YouTube video, and then we can all see it in action. I'm not saying it's not possible. I'm just saying I just haven't seen it. Uh, 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 uh. Even with uh, March, you're not getting hit every single time. Yeah, I mean the the pro the reason why I bring like Japard or the main the main MC is because at least when Japard doesn't get hit, he's at least shielding the rest of the team, right? Compared to where Clara's not supporting the rest of the team at all. <laughs> Ting, Branya, better. Both is better than uh, one or another tank. No, I usually run a tank, but this is just like easy street right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We might one shot this thing. I don't think we will. But we might. I think an extra turn there. Ooh. Damn, that was close. That TL60 grind, Joe Peck, good to see you, dude. Uh. Ooh. We refresh. We took the gamble. It did not work out. Pulse. Dun, dun, dun. Come on, something good to eat. Break a fat can suck my balls.
You're 60 next week. Nice, dude. All right. Dream alive. Ting is simming more than, uh, for now, than on Jing. Oh, yeah, yeah. You have to run Ting. Ting and Ting and Ting. Jing doesn't work without Ting. Well, I mean, you can use them as a, as a sub DPS, but you know what I mean. Uh, <laughs> How are you already level 60? Uh, because I spent money so I can make YouTube videos for you guys to be able to direct you guys to be able to farm correctly. So, um, there. That's why I have complete farming guides all the way from TL30 all the way to TL60 and our new calculator comes out tomorrow for TL60 grind. As an FYI, I just spent 2.3 million credits on two characters and over uh, 280 purple books. Just the level. Like, F my butt, dude. And, uh, it's not a Branya's uh, damage is not the reason that you it, Ting is better. It's the it's the energy charging that you need from Ting for um, Jing. Yeah, it's gonna be tough for free. Yeah, it would, no, you can you can plan accordingly. You can definitely plan accordingly as long as you're farming at the right TLs in the right spots. Just make sure you're not like overly farming gear or this or that in the wrong spots, right? Definitely possible. Balls. Yeah, let's like that. Uh-uh. Mm -mm -mm. yeah if you guys have any if you're new to this channel if you have any questions we also have over 30 videos on honkai star rail i have different calculators that tell you exactly how much stuff you need to get like at tl40 and tl50 tl 60s will be there tomorrow i have a guide on tl50 through 60 on what to farm at every single juncture in order to be prepared um and i do just general reviews and other stuff uh, so if you guys want exclamation point YouTube, you can join us on our YouTube channel. We just hit 30,000 subs on the tubes. Super Pog. So here, here is, here's the issue. You guys see my Ting Yoon right now? So this is why you have to get Ting Yoon to 80. You gotta get that, that last ascension. That little ball, that butt crack of a little bit of energy you need right there. Jesus Christ. That, like, that five energy a turn is what you need to fix that issue. God damn it, do you need... Uh, 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 uh. Need it. Dun, dun, dun. Is Zilla the best uh, single target ZPS? Yes. But not by much. Don Hung is pretty close. Assuming at E0. Um, but yes. She is the best single target right now. Technically, Don Hung does more damage than Yang Ching, but Yang Ching's more versatile. Yeah. 
天の神器を持って一心同期悪いおやすみ I don't know why I did that so early. <laughs> you think Jinx five star cone will go in the, the banner shop after a bit? Nope. I don't think that's in uh, Hoyo's bottom line. What? Did she? You jerk. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this thing's about to get pooped on. Here we go. Yep. That felt good. Can't believe they didn't crack the shield. Wow. Just wow. You got the recording? Sweet. Send it to me. I want to pog all over it. Dude, I appreciate it. Did you take, um, did you also record your, um, like a quick snippet of your gear and stats? Okay, cool. Appreciate it. Whoa! Yo, f off, Jesus! Holy shit! Uh, can you show each piece of gear? But you can just send me screenshots of that stuff. You don't have to actually record it. Wow, she is a, uh, she is being a giant pain in the butt. Wow. Well, that was interesting. Hey, we finally got an attack piece with the shittiest substats ever. Yay. Keep that. I mean, not really looking for speed. Unless we have the need for speed. Which we might. Feels weird, man. I agree. Yo, guys, I'm taking my son and my, well, my family, but mainly my son wanted to go. We're taking him to an indoor overnight water park on Monday. I'm really excited. You know my email address. It's uh, it's just down below. My business email is attached to Twitch. Yeah, I'm really excited. He's going to love it. He's definitely going to love it. Uh... You've been thinking about taking your diary? It's just super expensive at times, but uh, I got a deal. 
So for the whole family, we're only going for like 200 bucks. So I'm kind of excited. Did I not pull down Drapard? <gasps> Did I forget to pull someone down? Uh-oh. Rip. No, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Yeah, it's not too bad. I mean, typically it is pretty bad. Last one you went to? You want a scary one? Never again? What, a water slide? I've never heard of like a scary water slide, but maybe there is. Huge. She just did 36,000 damage. Huge. Huge. Uh oh. ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。ドゥドゥ。
千の珍奇を持って一心同期。TikTok for that. I've been,、uh, I've been uploading my guides to TikTok recently.、Um, I just don't have the time, but we've been doing it. Was she level 81? Yes. Huge. Oh man, don't use the lightning lord. No! But you're over! Oh, thank God. Nice. Love to see it. Yo, calm down. Oh, my dear Lord. God damn it, stop! Oh, my dear, what? You're, they're on some cheating bullshit right now. That it was some goddamn cheating bullshit. Bonus turns my butthole. Jesus. Stop it, Bronya! Oh my god, damn. Holy shit! What in the ball sex is happening? Oh, God. <laughs> that Prani needs to chill out 100%. Here we go. You're a. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> that lightning lord saved you? Didn't save me. It's calculated. <laughs> calculated. <laughs> Stop it. Which path is this, Elation? All right, got it, Joe Pet. I'm all over it. Appreciate it. Oh shit, this is gonna hurt. Oh boy. Lots of lots of death about to happen. Oh god! Yikes! Put her down, Lightning Lord! Put her down! Uh, that was fun. Easy. Wasn't even worried. Wasn't even worried. This is pretty good. Well, we got a whole lot of garbage today. That's great. You need 20,000 EXP for a singular level. Did I just read that right? You need 20,000 EXP for a singular level. What the fuck? What the fuck? Jesus. What's the highest? It's 70, I think. Oh my god. Yo, you guys like my stats on my Jing Yun if you just dropped in? 
I'm gonna have a soda real quick while you guys can stare at that. Yeah, still kind of nutty, right? All right. All right. So the video I need to work on for you guys tomorrow is the calculator right so we'll make a um i'll um i'll get all the numbers in tow but i'll get you guys the calculator if you guys haven't seen any of my calculators before these are on a lot of my videos i have one for tl40 i have one for tl50 what you can do is you can take uh these numbers right so if i was to zero this out right it'd be zero across the board but say I want to level a TL 50, say I want to level two five star heroes with, I don't know, six four star heroes, one five star light cone, seven four star heroes. It'll tell you how much of everything you need. It'll also tell you how many runs of everything you need to do. It'll also tell you how many overall runs it would take and how many days it would take you as a free to play from going from TL, you know, uh, TL 40 to 50, right, to get that shit done. It also take into account if you like say you have 500,000 credits right already. Um, you can put that in there. It'll take away some of the runs. Say you already have like 200 purples, right? It'll uh, it'll take that all into account. So you can put in your own metrics. So I have um, I have calculators for you guys. So this tells you how to optimize your ship. So I'll work on this one for you guys tomorrow. For TL60. Um. It makes it it makes it really easy to kind of like see where to plan your paths and what the farm. Yeah, I, I will make a Yukon guide. Um, as of right now, I think she's not good. We've already we've already uh, we can watch it again if you guys want to. Um, let me see if I can find it. Uh, we've already seen her in action. And um, she's got some things I really don't like about her. Here we go. Um, so there's uh, there's some things I really don't like about her. We can we can review this again if you guys want to right now. Um, so here's here's what I don't like about her. Um, so if you guys aren't aware of how she works, she has this bowstring, right? So essentially, whenever she scales, uh, she gets this bowstring buff. And what that means is that every every single attack after she gets the bowstrings, the next unit's going to do more damage. But the problem is that like you're going to have someone like March 7th that goes after her and uses a bowstring. That's a very bad design, right? So now you have to speed tutor to make sure that your primary DPS always goes after her so that your primary DPS uses a bowstring and not your healers or your tanks or some shit like that. So you have to perfectly speed tune her. Secondly, um, the thing I really don't like about her, um, there's one, oh, so there's one thing I do really like about her is that she's able to do double um, shield breaking on imaginary. So she has built-in uh, break efficiency. Um... Speed tuning is not that bad. Speed tuning right now is bad. Until you guys are max level and at like TL60 and you have most of your characters leveled and you've been farming gear at TL60. Um, Summer's War was all about it. Do not compare Summer's War to this game right now. We're not like... I've been playing Summer's War for seven years. No one is... No one's ready to speed tune yet, right? I've been playing Epic 7 for like three, right? You speed to him way later, right? That's why I mean, like, that's... You don't go after her now, right? <laughs> so, I, what I mean is, like, the speed tuning now is a bad idea, right? So, it's not a reason to pull her. Maybe later. Um, So. Because you let the speed tune everyone, right? 
Um, I do really like that she increases crit rate and crit damage. Uh, but but that's once again, it requires the bow strings. Um, two, the thing I really don't like is that she looks like she's her E1 is, I guess, okay. Her E2 is very important, regenerates additional energy. Um, but the problem I have is you need her E6. She looks almost unusable without her E6. Look at this shit right here. Whenever Yukong uses her ultimate, she immediately gains one stack of roaring, uh, a roaring uh, bowstring. So what that means is that you have to speed tune your team so that you scale before your primary DPS. And then for times that your primary DPS doesn't have a bowstring, you use your ultimate right before your primary DPS goes so you can get an additional bowstring to keep the bowstring alive. I am not a big fan of this. I am not a big fan of whatever this is. And that's the way I see her working. Um, so right now I'm not her biggest fan. I'm not, I'm not really her biggest fan. I am a big fan if you are going to bring her in to, sh to shield break against imaginary because she does have um, double the efficiency. I don't know where that was again, but her auto attacks do like double efficiency. I don't think they show it. I think it's this one right here. So she does double the, um, she does double the shield breaking on hit. She feels like a budget Branya. No, no. I would, I would not, I wouldn't like mid oh, how would I put her? Um, she's like a budget. I don't know. A budget Branya, you think? I think Branya is way better. I think she needs to be a six. From what I, I'm, I'm pretty good at guessing these things, and, and you're supposed to use her as a sub DPS. So she has a, she has an interesting role compared to Branya and Ting Yun, that are just pure supports. She's supposed to be a part support, part DPS, because her ultimate does damage. Um, so that's where she gets to be really interesting. Right? So, like, even when Rory Bowstrings is active, Yukong does 30% more damage to enemies. Like, she, she just doesn't seem viable before A4, A6. Ting Yun seems better. Brawny seems better. I, I'm not, I'm not sold on her, sadly. Also, the skill that makes you run faster? Who the f*** needs this? Who the f*** needs this? Come on. Bro. You, sh you shut your mouth, Cat Sora. <laughs> you do not need it. Faster farming. The maps are already like tiny penis sized. I want mods and mounts for Star Rail. So look at this. Look at that. You see how she's able to shatter a shield in one go? That's really cool. Don't get me wrong. That shit's really cool. And actually, you know what? I take it back. Here's a team that would work really well for Yukong. You got to get her the E6 or E4. Yukong primary DPS. Welt plus Locha plus Silver Wolf. But dude, like, wait, like who's going to build that team? You know what I mean? That's like the most copium team I've ever built in my brain. You know what I mean? Like, but that is, that could work. That team could work. I, it would work, right? It would work. You would be able to put uh, imaginary um, weakness on every target. She does double the breaking. Walt does ensnaring, does uh, sub DPS. She's your primary DPS. You bring Locha for the healing. It works. That team would work. But that is an insane amount of like, you have to pull shit to make that happen, right? That's an imaginary dream for free to play. It is. 
That's actually a really cool team. I just built that in my brain. That's actually a really... Honestly, if the if the game handed me Silver Wolf, Yukong at E6, and Locha, I would probably build that team. I'm not even lying. That's a Max Copium team. Right? If I had all that shit, I would probably build it. Because <laughs> that would be Pog. It would be Pog. But it's it's unsustainable for free to play. It's unsusp uh, unsustainable. Oh, that's another good point, Don. Uh, Don Hung's awakening. Um, so if you put Don Hung in there, I think she loses all her value. <laughs> Welt is better. <laughs> I, I, and you're gonna bring Locha for the healing, and you still bring Silver Wolf for the imaginary damage, right? You know what I mean? Am I saying imaginary? Am I? Am I supposed to be saying image? Image? I don't know what it's called. I always call them imaginary. I don't know what it's called. I something. It's like it's like I Apple. I just don't know what it's called. Imaginary? Imagine? Imaginary. You're saying it right? Okay, goddamn. Um, so here, so here's the problem, right? You see the bowstrings that just happened? Like this shit sucks, dude. Like it works with three characters, but as soon as you have four characters, it's completely copium. Like no one cares about. Look at that. Oh man. Oh March seventh. Oh, 236 damage. Oh man, thank you so much for using that bowstring. Holy shit. Mmm. Delicious. Oh, I can't wait to do it. Like, you know what I mean? If you don't speed tune that, right? It's just complete garbage. It's complete garbage. Eh. Like, you know what I mean? Like, eh. Like, what's nice is that it does double the break effect. So, you know how I would build her? I would honestly build her break effect. I would. It's, uh, it's, mm, uh, generic. I got it. Um, this would be the first character I would ever build for break effect. Does her buff scale off or anything? I don't think so. Nope. Uh, oh, attack. It does scale off attack. Uh, wait, no, it doesn't. This is her buff. Uh... When bowstring is active, increases the attack of all allies by 44%. It doesn't scale off shit. It doesn't scale off shit. Uh, all allies crit rate increases by 21, crit damage by 41. The same time deals imaginary damage by 243% of Yukong's attack. <laughs> like, in theory, this is really good. Like, this is a really good buff. Don't get me wrong. But you know what I mean? Like, if you can't speed tune her properly, that your main... DPS uses this all the time. You know what I mean? It gets it just gets to be very weird. I don't know. I'm not I'm not 100 percent sold on her. And the, the main reason I'm not sold on her is is for the is for is her Eidolons. In theory, she's really good, but until you can get Eidolon 6, where you can get an immediate bowstring for times that you buy actually run out of the bowstrings for your main DPS. You know what I mean? So, you know, I think we have this conversation a little bit later once she's finally like E6. Yeah, I know it's just an early problem, but I mean, it's going to be a problem for the next like four months, five months, right? For most players. But it's not a reason. Here's the thing. Even though you guys say it's an early game problem, 
That is not a reason to pull the banner to get her. But by the way, you're going to get her for free in 1.2 anyways. If your goal is to get Yukong, that's not a reason to pull this banner. It's not. It's all about the luchas. Uh, uh, uh. Must pull Kafka. You're right. 100%. Uh, what do we have left to do today? I am like out of energy. Unless I pop potions. We can get any new gear. Because the game hates me. Did I get no get new gear? Um... Oh, God. I think that's better than what I actually have on her is the problem. Oh, God, that rolled terribly. Um... <laughs> oh, God, this sucks, too. All right, we might as well just destroy this thing. Where's the other one at? <laughs> God damn. Maybe this rolls crit rate or crit damage? Did you quit Tower Fantasy? No, we played it yesterday. Oh, dear Lord. Yep, that's dead. Wow. 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 Well, we'll keep looking. We'll keep looking. We played our, uh, we played with Yulun yesterday. She was a lot of fun. We did a lot of shit yesterday with Tower of Fantasy. We played with our new punchy punchy girl. Save the, the potions for double drop day. I don't even think you'll need the potions for double drop day, right? Because they only allow you to do like three hits of the double drop. Guess we can do this. What piece are you looking for? Just a good attack piece. That's not a good attack piece. Just to finish her off. Just to finish her off. What, what was that noise? What the fudge? Senpai with the one bitty. Dude, I appreciate it. I didn't even know that was a noise. Are you having problems finishing her off? I never have problems finishing. Let that let that be a lesson to you for even questioning that. I will always finish. Uh, uh, uh. Is Shusheng your main DPS? No, Jing Yuan is. Shusheng's my second. Tomorrow's MOW day. We're gonna try and get through as much MOW as we can. MOW day. Do 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 do. Uh, 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 uh. All right. What am I doing? Oh, why did I bring Branya? Why did I do that? Oh, thank God I didn't get Svarog. Hey, do you guys, uh, how many people are playing Aether Gazer if you just jumped into the channel? We were going to play that tonight. If you guys didn't see, um, I may have pulled this on one of our rerolls. Giggity. Delicious. Uh, I'm like level one. I haven't even started. Maybe we'll play a little bit once we uh, once we finish here. Saturday night. Oh, we were gonna watch the, we we're gonna watch the anime movie tonight too. Man, you guys know we uh, we sometimes do anime nights, and I just got my hands on uh, 
I just got my hands on the new uh on the new uh, Sword Art Online movie. Which if you haven't seen the progressive movies, like the first one, god damn that movie was so good. It was so good. Just got our hands on the second one. I uh really want to watch it. Yeah, if you guys haven't seen the progressive movies, it goes back to their roots. In the root, it's so good. The first movie is so good. God damn, I get the tingles. You know, you, you know when you get those like really nice tingles and you're like, ah, oh, ah. Oh. No, it has nothing to do with the series. As long as you've seen, um, as long as you've seen the first season, it goes back to the first season and it's a, it's a different, it's kind of like um, Fate Stay Night where they go down a different timeline. Like if something was to change. I've seen one episode. You, you only have to see any episode to watch these movies. They have nothing to do, essentially, with the, the anime. You can know absolutely zero. You think those are horny tingles? So what? So what? So what if they are? There's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with some horny tingles. To deny yourself the pleasures of life is to deny yourself yourself. Okay. Why the fudge is he not scaling? What? This potato AI. Yeah, uh, auto, uh, auto in this game. I wish you can customize it more. I wish I can give it like variables like, hey, heal if you're at lower than 70. Always buff this person. If he has buff, auto attack, right? I wish I can customize it. That would be a great quality of life improvement. I really have to fight Svarog, you piece of dog poop. <laughs> Wow. Oh, okay. Wow. Thanks for punching my ting in the face. Really appreciate that. <laughs> you? Uh, my ting's too fast. Oh. No, not my ting. Well, that felt good. Uh, I don't know why I did that. Voice is badass in JP, it is. My ting. Can we wait for the big reveal that Ting has a uh, hidden aggro percentage? Uh, 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 
victory. Alright. Cool. Done. Give me the free stuff. Hell yeah, they make these battles random when they're not. Wait, you mean they're not random? I feel lied to. I feel lied to. <laughs> Jing just handing out the spankings. Don't worry, most people that come in the channel, they're like, my Jing doesn't hit as hard as yours. Is he E6? Nope. Just cracked off. I'd love to hit 4,000 attack. I need to find a better relic. Like that rolled like shit. Um. Yeah, I have his light cone. Oh, I finally got a lightning boost one. That's those stats suck. Crit rate. Hmm. Are you planning to put lightning damage? Eh. As of right now, no. Unless I find like a really good lightning damage boost one. He's working fine. You know what I mean? Holy shit. Look at the stats on that one. Uh, 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 uh. What do I need to, uh, you know, we're going to start working on trying to get Ting to, uh, Ting really badly needs, um, she really needs this. She really badly needs this. I guess we start working on her ascension materials, which I almost have. Oh, shit. Pog. What team do I have on right now? What the fuck? Like the copium team. Uh, uh, uh. This is the copium team. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. Yeah. Should have brought fire MC. <laughs> What? No crit? Wow. Feels bad. Hey, team's damage is pretty dish. Huge. <laughs> Wait, you run attack orb on your Jing? Yep. Have you the same? I have a good attack orb? Yeah, why not? I mean, you guys have seen my Ting and my uh, Jing Yu in, in action all night. I don't see why you wouldn't. I don't know. I think Jing needs his light cone. I agree. But there's there's other good light cones. All right, breakfast is really good and pretty comparable. Na, 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 na. 
軍の実力やおおおおおおお How many do we need? I need two more. Oh. Do I have anything I can synthesize? No. RIP! Yeah, breakfast is solid. How much energy do I have? Do I have enough? Oh, 30. Perfect, right? 30 for this. Perfect! Did I bring Fire MC instead? You only have 3,000 J's as a free to play? Rip. That'll happen. Nice. Have you tried Aether Gazer? Yep. You want to see uh, what we just did in Aether Gazer? Here you go. This was on my third reroll. I have a level one account. Level 10, I guess, whatever I Then we quit. Yep. Yeah, we. I haven't had time to play. We've been too. It's the typical, the typical curious problem. I uh, too many games. I don't know what I'm doing. All right. Oh, was beat to a little bit better. Brian, should be going after my shoe shank. Oh, man. You suck. Nice hit. I nah, just do it. Can't do skills again? What is even happening right now? Eighteen thousand break damage, Jesus. All right, cool. Yo, we got everything we wanted to do tonight. Let's ascend her. I'm actually not gonna level her. You guys are gonna think I'm crazy. I'm not actually gonna level Ting Yun. I just want to ascend her so I can get this this right here. Mmm, delicious. Oh, delicious. Is there any world where the physical MC is useful? Nope. Terrible. Oh god, thank god. Now that feels good. You're using that light cone instead? What light cone? I do need to get this at some point, but I don't really need it right now. Do, 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 do. All right, so that fixes Ting Yun's problem. And then next we got to send Branya so we can get this. And then after that, I'm actually, I'm actually probably not going to send anyone else to 80. Except for maybe the fire MC because it's free. Uh, but I don't really need this. I don't actually need shit. The defense boost would be good. I like how I'm missing out on like 25% defense boost. And I already have 3000 defense. God damn. Um... What characters you got in either Gazer? Did you reroll? I rerolled three times. Shinri is good. I have her. Is that the ninja girl? Who's the ninja girl? Oh, that's uh, Jin E. Right? Is that her name? Jin E. She's terrible. 
Shinri is good. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we're not going to really level anyone else. Oh, I forgot I got Himiko. But I don't really have the shit for Himiko, so we're not going to level her either. World 3 or World 6 for Gear for Zila? Uh, World 3. Zila doesn't really do follow up, right? Both both are kind of comparable. You can do either. But World 3 would probably get you better gear for some of your other characters. Dun, 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 dun. It's the Dig Raid! Yo, what's going on, Dig? Guys, go check out Dig. Drop that follow right now. All you gotta hit that. All you gotta do is hit that heart right there. You only have to leave the channel. Why are you not gonna level them? I don't need to level them right now. And also, I, I already spent $3 million. I'm now below a million again. We were at we were at above three million earlier tonight. When invite me. What the fudge? Alright, so we're in a really good spot. Three million USD. Yeah, dude. Yeah, you guys get you have to be very careful about who you're leveling right now. Be very pick and choosy. And you want to level people that only really require you to get this idol on. Or this, this ability. If this ability sucks, you don't need to get them to level 80. Like, there's so many characters that you don't need that shit. You know what I mean? Like, you don't need your pards. Who gives a shit about that, right? Attack increases by 35% of defense? Who gives a rat's ass about that? You know what I mean? Like, some of these are just complete dog shit. You know what I mean? Um, you don't need Astas. You don't need Palas. Uh, you know, you don't need, you don't need servals. You don't need any, you don't need anyone's like most of, most of them are just pretty trash. When current HP is higher than 80% crit rates increase. I mean, I guess that's pretty good. Oh, great. A, a character that can tickle can tickle marginally harder. Exactly. Right. But there's like, there's big ones like Shu Shangs is really good. Right. Don Hugs is really good. Right. Uh, Jing Yuans is really good. Uh, Bronyos is insane. Uh, uh, Tings is insane because you need that energy recharge. Like, so there's really good ones out there. Actually, I don't know what Zila's is, but I assume Zila. Your primary DPS usually always get jacked to the tits. What does hers do? Let me see. If she's using a basic attack, Zila's uh, next uh, action will uh, advance forward 20%. No. But you need this and this. So, yes. Like, that's 10% crit damage and another 8% attack. Yo, Filter, have a good night. Thanks so much. Uh, this is actually dog shit. I mean, how often do you basic attack with Zila? It should be almost never. Right? Uh, 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 uh. Only on mobs, you're okay. The one shot. Yeah, I mean, at that point, does it even matter? You know what I mean? I only basic attack with Zila. Shut up. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> no, you don't. Yeah, I think they're expired. I'll take them off. Deleted. Um. All right. I think we're done for the day. Have you played Aether Gazer yet? Yes. Should we play should we play like 30 minutes of Aether Gazer or should we go watch should we go watch the first movie of Sword Art Online? Did you like it? I do like it. I've I've played Aether Gazer before on this channel. We played the CN version. You want me to jump on my CN account and show you guys mommy uh Dark Osiris? Who just like face rolls everything in the game? I don't I, 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 She has an angelic form, and you just smash buttons and everything dies. Big fan. 
big fan but what's going on yeah we just uh we just uh i'll show it again just to trigger everyone i just did this on my uh re-roll account pog Ugh. Mm, delicious Anyone comment on that? Oh, I like this comment. So, uh, Silver Wolf's going to be a must pull, right? No, I don't think so, unless you're Unga Bunga. She requires very specific teams with stacked elements to be viable. Very specific teams. Are you high? Yeah, I'm high as. I'm high as. I'm high as all f balls. What a, what a, what a great comment. Well said. Well played, dude. <laughs> Pog. This is, this is the person you don't take advice from on pulling Silver Wolf. I'm just, I'm going to say that right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, dude, Pog, look at this. Yes! We know that she'll allow any team in the game, but if she can't apply the correct element since it's random, then it becomes not that good. So she'll make mono elemental teams better. Well said! You are obviously smart. Well said. You're gonna get a snack ready for the movie? Do we watch the second movie or we watch the first movie? Or do I or do I play some Aether Gazer? I don't know. What do you guys want me to do? Uh, uh, we got I gotta like figure out a day where we can actually play Aether Gazer. I should be doing videos for that game because I don't think anyone's really doing videos for that game. I should do the Dark Osiris video since you should pull for her. You pull now. Uh, let me do a little bit here and then maybe we'll watch the first movie for people that haven't seen the movie and then we'll do the second movie at some point. You just came in. I haven't looked closely at Silver Wolf. I don't know if you uh, want to rail on this topic again. Uh, she effectively, she, she applies weakness based on the allies elements. So if you build teams that have multiple elements, she's, there's a good chance that she puts so weakness of the element that is not right. Why is my, why does this not open fully on my screen? Is there something wrong with this game where it doesn't open fully on my screen for some reason? What the fudge? Like the Ch the Chinese version opens fully on my screen. Huh? What is happening right now? Um, so she's, uh, she's, she requires you to have a good repertoire of teams right now. You can only make mono element teams for like lightning and, and ice and barely for both of those. Right. So for her to get maximum usability, you gotta, you gotta stack her with mono teams. This is the gazer. We're just gonna, we're just gonna slap some things real quick. And then since I just picked up mommy twice. I've learned a lot. Thank you. You're welcome. And then do do do. As long as I can get more power. More power. Uh Dun, dun, dun. Yo, she's pretty pog, in all honesty. Uh, we don't have any of those. Uh, 
I forget who she um Yes. How do I see this? Who does Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. Okay, cool. You're on the fence on whether you want to pull. I think everyone should. I think most people should pull Silver Wolf on the second rotation. I think Silver Wolf is going to be meta, but I don't think she's going to be meta until we have enough characters to make her meta. Does that make sense? But like, I think pulling her now would do you an injustice when other characters would help you more. She's like the Mona of... Uh, of Honkai Star Rail. This is uh, Aether Gazer just came out. I just wanted to try playing with our new mommy real quick. Do, 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 do. Um, you may, uh, we need her, right? And then we need, that's probably sign. Did I not save it? God damn it. I hate when I do that. Do you save confirm need a plan name? Z. How do I change to this team? Change. Nice. Fuck. I'm gonna crush you, smash you, crack you all. I refuse to pull husbandos. Mm-hmm. 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 Low shot and blade combo? Absolutely amazing. Correct. Since I have welts and I'm planning to get Locha and Imaginary Dan. Exactly. Like that's great, Drago. I think I think um I think you pick her I if, I think we pick her up on rerun. I think she's I think she's a little too early to the game that only whales will be able to really maximize her. And I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. Unsheathing. I can get even stronger. Tricks on Anything alive? What the fuck? Be careful, everyone. You two stop right there. Blah 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 blah. Hey, we helped you guys. Hand over the AGI mecha or you ain't going anywhere. Dual flash. Uh, she's way too powerful right now. I still have confusion in my mind. God, her Victory boobs are nice. Wait, did I say that part out loud? Shit. Who's the next character after uh, Shinri? Uh, you keep saying Shinri. You mean... Is that her last name? Uh, it should be Dark Osiris should be next, and both of them are must-pulls. Unsheathing. Both of them will take you to the end game of this game. You'll never have to pull anything ever again. I can get even stronger. God damn, she's too powerful. I still have confusion in my mind, but victory like these missions should be, should be way harder. Uh Uh, oh, you like my deck cam? If you guys, uh, this is how I play on mobile. If you guys have never seen. I actually have a. It has a controller and everything built into it. This is how I play. This is a phone. This is how I play on mobile. So, like when I play games like this that don't have like controller support, it allows me to to map anything I want, which is really nice. All right. So if I need to like key map something, I can make my own key mappings. Free pog. Yeah, it's a really cool phone. Ugh. 
This is also how I stream uh, all the games we play while I'm in like hotel rooms when I have to be away on business. I just stream from my phone and then bring a mic with me. I can get even stronger. She is way too powerful. I can't even get my ultimates up. I still have confusion in my mind, but victory shall be my god. The only problem, I mean, this, the, there's no problem with the game. The problem is that, I mean, if you're used to PGR, you're used to styles like this, where you just like zone in and, and kill things. Shinri. We're just all I'm used Shin. to like open world games. I can get even stronger. I will protect everything I hold dear. Useless. I still have confusion in my mind. Yeah, we've heard we've heard you the first time. The first like five thousand times. You have confusion in your mind, we get it. We be making the Aether Gazer guides? I don't know. I am uh I'm struggling with time management right now since I have a full time job. I have two full time jobs, technically. I've got two kids, and I could barely get out content for one game. So I do the best I can, guys. I do the best I can. <laughs> Where do you find the time to sleep? I get about four hours a night. I sacrifice sleep in order to make content for you guys. Sadly. I mean, not sadly, right? Don't overwork yourself. I know it's, I love making content though. Like I really do. I really, I like building communities. I like finding people that love the games that we play. I'm really excited for like blue protocol coming out. A lot of other games that we have coming out. Right, lots of cool shit on the horizon. I will protect everything I hold dear. God damn, I can't even get my ultimate up. Jesus. You're so energetic with four hours of sleep. I, I love it. Confusion in my mind. It's caffeine. Victory shall be my guide. Uh, uh, uh. I sacrificed game time for sleep. That's smart. Smart. Work at night in the hotel at receptionist. If I slept four hours, I would spend at least half of my time taking a nap. So it's called power napping, dude. Nap while awake. That's the next level play. Is that a backbone? No, it's uh so the the rog phones. The rog phones have their own built-in uh you could buy it, it's just their own controller. Over here. Slides off. Unable to activate. So if I wanted to play it as like a switch, I could. Um so the rog phones have their own built-in controller scheme stuff. And then the best part is that you can map it to anything you want. You can make macros, you can do whatever you want. 
really nice actually so like if you were to go here right i could do like different air triggers if i wanted to do triggers on the top here right so i could turn these on right you see how i can tap on the top of my phone and there's touch tactile tap screens that you could put those anywhere if i want to move those around right i could um there's motion controls you could do for it you can also if in case the game doesn't have built-in key mappings you can set your own key mappings so i can set my like my a b c d right everywhere i want to do what's the battery life on that pretty dish but i mean i have it plugged in all the time so like it's hard to tell shinri unsheathing i can get even stronger enemy down <laughs> don't you think you want a bit overboard no more agi methods coming what was that it where the fudge am i going oh be careful everyone Dun, 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 dun. Hey, I don't want to be the legs, but it looks like I have no choice. Hurry up. What two characters do you recommend for either gazers? Get the limited. The first limited, Tsukuyomi. And then get uh Dark Osiris, and you'll never have to pull a character ever again. Not even joking. Uh, was that a transformation? Zenbo. Let's go. Understood. Quill. Thunder. And I thought only a Kalunas was designed to allow this. Please Ow. kill everyone's Your spirit. Bumping into me. Damn. Shut. You got. Did and you say shit? <laughs> mind, you got dominated. Be my God. You only need Dark Osiris. She's not that good. She's actually really good. Dark Osiris was able to solo all of Aether Gazer in the, in the CN for like a year. That's the core. Yeah, but who cares, right? You know what I mean? Like pick a character that's going to face roll all the content. There's not like, there's not like overwhelmingly hard content in this game. Shinri, unsheathing. So that's what I mean. If you have both of those characters, right, you'll be good for like the whole year. Hey, their gazer is not the hardest game in the world. confusion in my mind but victory shall be my god like so here's what i'm gonna say right do you need dark osiris no but i'm telling you like there's just like there's just not a lot of min max content in this game or at least there wasn't in the cn for so long that like you might as well pick I'm telling you, like, if you pick Dark Osiris and you pick Tsukuyomi, you'll never have to, you, you really don't have to pull shit. You really don't. Like, yeah, I get what you're saying. You want to get Hera and Hades. I get that to do a more optimal team. But man, dude, Dark Osiris, I can smash my face against the keyboard and win every single match, right? She's like the easiest character in the game to play. Right? Like you smash all the abilities, you hit ultimate, you get a whole nother set of abilities that all do AOE and you just smash that shit constantly. She is like the literally the easiest character in the game to play. And she'll get you through everything. And for times you want to min max, you got Tsukuyomi and whoever else you get, right? Shinri. You want hard? It's PGR. And it's funny, I don't want PGR. I mean, I do want PGR. I love PGR. I but I mean, I uh, I've got skill issues in my brain. I can get even stronger. My sword is my mind. Yeah. Yeah. Useless. Yeah. 
So like this game's a lot easier for my boomer brain. My Damn, that was huge. I still have confusion in my mind, but victory shall be my god. Yeah, PG the problem I have with PGR is um the same problem that the PGR community that I have with the PGR community that was Wuthering Waves. We just recently played Wuthering Waves. And a lot of the PGR community was screaming the game wasn't hard enough. And I do think they should make it slightly harder, and there's some things they should change. I get that. And there's some things they need to optimize. But my problem is that PGR turns off so many players, it's not even funny. Like, they barely, they don't, like, they're, the amount of monetization that PGR is making isn't as much as I think they could make. And it's mainly because it's just a very not friendly game to the average gamer. Even though PGR is great. But when you have to pull off, like, 170 hit combos and, like, perfect synergy... You know what I mean? It's just, there's only there's only like a, a a very small percentage of people that want that shit, nice right? To meet you. So how do you how do you balance that properly? It's hard. Do you like this more than PGR? I do personally. It's just my personal opinion, though. But I think PGR has better content to do because PGR is more fleshed out. Um, I just like the simplicity of the combat more here for my own for my own boomer brain. You even pay attention to the story? No, the story doesn't get good till later. The beginning part of the story is pretty trash, but I do like that it's all voice acted, so it's kind of nice. Is that a ten pull? Holy shit! Yo, they're they're pretty damn generous. They're giving away a lot of free shit. Holy shit! I should do a reroll guide for this. Maybe I do a reroll for this game tomorrow. Reroll guides are pretty pretty damn hot right now. Yo, you get Sinku for 99 cents, and then also you get for 299? God, that's a pretty good deal. Some pretty good wow. Pretty good bundles. Pretty easy to hit pity in a, not, uh, a few days. Yeah, but you know what I mean? Like if you can pull Sukuyomi like or, like early, like no one needs to go to pity when you can save it for the next character. I haven't done my pulls here. I wonder what I'm going to get. I actually don't want a, a Sura. I'm really not a big fan of a Sura. Uh, not to say, not saying she's bad. But I would love to pull. I'd love to pull like, uh, uh, I don't even know. Let me think. Um, uh, probably a Sura, right? Or not a Sura, uh, sorry, uh, um, Poseidon, probably? Yeah, she's good in AoE, yeah, but, like, you know, I'm, this is what it is. Is there any multiplayer content in PGR Aether Gazer? I don't think so. Yo, Jelly, what's going on, dude? Guys, check out Jelly. Absolutely amazing. Plays a lot of the same games we do. Is also going to be playing Blue Protocol with us in like two weeks. If you guys didn't know, we're going to be playing the Japanese version of Blue Protocol. It's coming out uh, June 14th. I cover it on my YouTube channel. I've got a ton of videos for uh, Blue Protocol. We'll be playing the Japanese version. I'll get you guys all prepared for the global version. Unfortunately, it's not coming out till next year. But uh, we got it. Big chill at the moment. Yo, Jelly, dude. We're going to be rocking that content, right? We're going to be rocking that content hard. Ooh, here we go. Hundred percent, dude. Yeah, hundred percent. Let's go. 
what's uh what class are you going are you going uh are you gonna do um um are you gonna do archer again is the japanese vl thought blue pro no comes out comes out in two weeks yo endless good to see you dude if you guys don't know you guys should really follow my youtube channel i've been covering blue pro Club for a while and i just covered that's coming out in two weeks you do keen strider first since i played that in the nt really enjoyed it that's the archer right yeah sweet I, i'm gonna play um um the ages fighter first that sets us up for success for doing whatever we want to do you re-rolled we did i thought blue protocol comes out october this year nope got delayed for global till next year and you want to know why you want to know why it got delayed because i found out amazon is publishing throne in liberty and that shit comes out in november december so i have almost i am almost positive they delayed it on purpose to not compete with the other game that they're launching I'm almost positive. I know they should bench Throne in Liberty over it. Like, I know it's just, oh, it's ridiculous. Nice. Uh, Sakura. Nice. I think I, I think I just won the game, guys. I think I just won the game. I pulled a double Sukuyomi in a single ten pull, and then I got Asura at the same or not Asura. I got uh, I think I just won the game. I think I just got the I just I think I just got the God tier account. Uh, yeah. What's up? I think I literally just got the God tier account. Yes. <laughs> is the japanese version available to everyone not technically but yes and they uh you know what's really interesting now jelly back me up on this so we were watching the japanese uh live stream of blue protocol and they made so many hints to hey we know you're going to be playing not in japan but you just can't you can't join on these events they said they said some really interesting shit like they know people are going to be playing in the Japanese version which leads me to believe that they're not going to ban people outright. I think they're still going to require you to get a VPN and shit and not be like like unless you get reported for being obnoxious and saying things in English and shit. Um I don't think they're really going to go out of their way to ban people. Yeah, like, why would you go out of your way to say it's Japanese exclusive on a Japanese exclusive live stream? You know what I mean? It, it got me. I was like, you know what? You guys are being very tricky. You guys are being very tricky with your wording. You're saying it's okay to play your game, which is not to join in on, like, the free computer giveaways and shit. No Poseidon account ruined. Well, that might be true. Yes. We got some Shinri's, Understood. though. I've improved. I'm gonna work even harder from now on. And uh you gonna try Black Clover Global? I don't um a mobile? Uh I don't think I will. I might, I don't know. Yes. I guess I should have pulled on this instead of uh Oh, I don't have any of these anyways. I guess that's the, the only thing we really need to win here is I need to get um oh shit what which one does um which one does uh Tsukuyomi get in the use shit I forget which one she uses she's a flower so she uses this one right here that'd be the only thing we need to fully 
win the account. The third one. Yeah, it's not the yeah, it's the pink one. Yeah. Um Somehow you can't download the game. Go to Tap Tap. You can download it from Tap Tap or from Q App. That's how I download games when it's uh, blocked in your your region. Is transcending A tier Sukuyomi the same as getting the S tier from her banner? No. Two different characters. Leave it to me. Two different characters. And then... Yes. I mean, then again, they also point out that the global release in the live stream. So they probably knew that EN was uh, people were watching. No, I don't think they they did that. I think they just did it to, to say it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But it is what it is, I guess. Understood. This has enriched my combat experience. Wait, hold on a second. Uh, uh, I didn't realize they used the same one, which is fine. Can I catch up to Shisho with this? I don't know. Can you catch up to Shisho? Shisho by the Shishide? Oh, they all use the same one. Yo, son of a biscuit, dude. Son of a biscuit. Uh, can't let me break this shit yet. Oh, I can't. Nice. I'm in level two low. No! Balls. Yo, we have a really crack starting account. You learn any Japanese, Kiros? Other than like the hundred words of Japanese I know? No. I, um... But I'm not going to be super obnoxious and say anything in English, obviously, right? I know how to, I know how to mind my P's and Q's. It's a hundred more words than I know. Yeah. I mean, I'll do some auto translate if I need to. I'll translate as much as I can. Um, but I, I, I have a feeling like, like I'll know how to join party and shit. Like, but I have a feeling I won't really have to talk, talk. Great guild wins. I don't know. We already have two guilds for either gazer. Administrator, the information on spilt industries has been compiled. The only, the only words I need to know is Chi-Chan! I'm glad to be of help to those who go into battle. Well then, I'll take my leave. Call me anytime if you need anything, admin. Uh, 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 uh. Wait, where is it at? Hold on a second. I wasn't, I wasn't queued up for the Chi-Chan! Oh, man. Moment ruined. Moment ruined. どうしたの?トールさんが叫ぶ見せてる時の顔が好き。そう。もっと長く見てたいな。ああ。ラングラング。<笑> <笑>あ、<笑><笑> 
前にも言ったねあの長い人<笑>長い叫ぶ海<笑>少し Everybody brought forward Hey Oh sh shit, they were still talking. Crap. Mistakes were made. Fortunately for Spield, three years ago, there was an AGI mecha riot that shook all of New Hansa. New Hansa! They wandered the streets aimlessly, smashing store window displays. <laughs> more. We need more. To cut cars by the roadside. The, the convenience of the new AGI mecha models appealed greatly to the general public and businesses. And public opinion guided the appeal along. Uh -huh. Everyone soon forgot about that incident. Nice. Spielt people now call him the Lion of New Hansa. And they laud his leadership. You always need a longer like long man. Wow. That's, that's uh that is something to say. But what exactly had Eugene Spielt done to bring Spielt Industries back from the death? Alright, good enough. I mean, I've already technically read this plot once. Shinri, unsheathing. I can get even stronger. Tricks aren't ever. Vanish! An enemy. Right on time. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> You just download the other gazer? Nice. How long are we talking? Listen, I don't. Jesus. A gentleman never tells. Hiding around like mice. Uh, you brats are really. Shinri, unsheathing. Enjoy it. I am enjoying it. Exterminate current target. Oh, hello. Yeah, damn, I do too much damage. Calm down, everyone. God damn. We're just too powerful right now. I still have confusion in my mind, but victory shall be my god. And, uh, I still think people pull Dark Osiris. That's my own person. Uh, at least I'll tell you what. I'm pulling Dark Osiris because I love her. And I'm a potato, and I like any kind of character where I can just smash my face in the keyboard. Am I winning? Yes! Unsheathing. I can get even stronger. There. I will protect everything I hold dear. If I get the weapon and awaken it to the purple lady, she's the best for Shinri. Wait, what? Huh? Do what now? Come again? Words? Shinri, unsheathing. Uh. I can get even stronger. Tricks aren't everything. Uh. -uh. Come on, here we go. Yeah, I love having a controller. Makes life a lot easier playing this game. Nice. Mm -mm -mm. I still have 
confusion in oh yeah right right i use the ps4 controller and ld player nice this game this game requires a controller in my opinion System is either Gator's storyline good? I mean, Stish. In my identity. opinion. It gets better way later. Like, way later on. Like, once we get, like, a year into the game. It's, it's Stish. Registration complete. Eugene Spield has been confirmed as the new supervisor of the AI Alphas. The system's highest permission... You can choose region. I think there's only two regions anyways. Blockhead Jolin. There's plans. global and then not Become global. Someone else's puppet. <laughs> System permissions reauthorized. Awaiting supervisor's orders. Alphas, take inventory of the AGI mecha reserves uh -huh. in the underground levels and transfer their command to me. Data integration in progress. Please stand by. Eugene. Why are you almost you ruined your account choosing which one to awaken? To I gotta look at it. AGI mecha transfer? If these things are found, you know what will happen, right? The tone you're using with me is getting more and more undisguised, Loki. What? Do you understand what's going on right now? Don't forget that Spielt only lent you this place for your production base. I never said you are the only <laughs> Spielt Industries is mine. God. Oh, Alphys, see this. Put nice. Did you think I'd be un- All right, good enough. Shinri, unsheathing. I can get even stronger. Can you down? The ocean I will protect everything I hold dear. Useless. Uh, too easy. I heard you can auto bell. How do you do that in the, the settings? The I have no idea. In all honesty, I have no freaking clue. And, uh, oh, look, it's regular Osiris, not regular to be confused with Dark Osiris. But I'll do my best. Okay, you fools are... Don't you disappoint me, crap. I saw that coming already. Ha! No problem. I'm here. Yes, my cat. Uh uh. Yes. Oh, this is getting fun. Nice. Is that all we're supposed to do? These battles, that's the only problem I had with this game in the beginning, is I feel like it's just too easy. Like, you can get all the way through, like, stage seven, like, you know, or like chapter seven without ever doing anything. Maybe that, maybe that's just me, though. I can get even stronger. What the fuck? Dude, what the hell? Just let the AI take care of it, you AMK farm. Oh my god. That's funny as hell. Is it good getting dupes of Sukuyomi? I mean, it is good. I mean, all dupes are going to be good for you. Increases your power. I'm going to go out of my way for dupes, but if it happened naturally, just make it happen. Can get even stronger. Sword is my mouth. Shit's not dead. Oh, what? Mm 
Uh, I can't even get my ultimate fast enough before these missions end. Tigger to Omega tier. I need more dupes of Kiri. Everyone needs another dupe of Kiri. Everyone. Unsheathing. Uh... I can get even stronger. Enemy down. Yeah. Yeah. Did you the wings? <laughs> An enemy. Right on to no yeah. now, you guys. I still have confusion in my mind, but victory shall be my guide. Too easy. All right, let's hit level 20 and then we'll probably call that a thingy. Mr. Jolin. I do need to play this game some more. Probably make some videos, I don't know. Unsheathing. I, can get even stronger. I should really make a reroll guide on like this is the best time to play the game with especially considering you get like uh 30 to 40 free summons to get Sukuyomi like be careful everyone I can't imagine playing this game without her Uh, uh, uh. You enjoyed AG? I've always enjoyed AG. Um, I'm more excited to see what the end game loop kind of looks like on this game. Um, because I never really got to in the CN version because when we played it, the game almost flopped. It looks like they're doing a lot better now. Shinri, unsheathing. Okay, you. Hey, zero one. This is our first time working together, right? I can it would be nice if you can stop holding no, me what? Yeah. Huh? That's my line, damn it! It seems their relationship is pretty complicated. My blades decide all. Slash. Ooh, this is getting you fun! Yeah. Yo, this, guy, this dude is getting cracked like no other. Damn. I still have confusion in my mind. You don't really need a healer to clear harder content. Yeah, you just need to dodge better, right? It's like the PGR approach. Just dodge everything, forehead. All right. Well, I think on that note, we'll call it a night. We'll have to figure out some time to play some more. They've definitely been very generous with the newcomer event and everything. Jesus Christ. Like, look at all these free shit. Look at all this free shit. They've, uh, they've definitely been very generous. I, I don't know. I don't know the last time I've seen a game be this generous. You know what I mean? It's like a, it's like a rare sighting. Dun, 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 dun. but i think on that note we're gonna call it a night uh i don't typically stream tonight so i want to thank everyone for hanging out on our off night i will be back tomorrow we'll do uh i'll have a i'll have some videos for um Honkai star rails since we hit tl60 i'll give you guys some advice there um we start doing my character guides now and 
then maybe I'll do some Aether Gazer videos. We got some Tower of Fantasy videos coming because 3.0 is on its way. And we got some Blue Protocol videos coming because that's on its way. We got a ton of shit to do. Um, finally, some normal streaming time, right? Exactly. Uh, no one week stream. We mean no one week stream. What does that mean? What does that mean? I got shit to do, man. I can't be streaming for a whole week. Uh, I would love to. I would love to do that, but I can't be doing that. Uh, so, uh, I think, so, I think that's all we got. I think that's all we got. Subathon. I don't do subathons anymore because I don't believe in taking people's money like that. Uh, the only time I think I would ever do a subathon again is if, uh, if we did it for charity. Um, I don't, I don't really want to take your guys' money. So I'd rather you guys use it for yourselves, pay your bills, you know, spend some in your gotcha game. So you guys love it. If you guys sub, you know, I love you for subbing and stuff like that, but that's more than enough. Um, so have a good night. You guys have been great. I'll see you guys later. I'll see you guys tomorrow. And, uh, that's all I got. That's all I got. Uh, maybe, man, maybe anime night next week. Maybe next Saturday we do a, do a double, double header movie. Watch both movies, maybe, right? You guys want to do that? We can do that. Uh, all right, guys. I'll see you guys later. Peace.